Hey, what's going on? It's your boy Joe Thunder back once again with another episode of the Smoking Joe Thunder podcast. Podcast, podcast. Brought to you by Be Good Dispensaries. You know, they got all your marijuana needs. Look them up. You know what I mean? They got that fire, fire. Latest and greatest in hip hop and cannabis news. We got another banger for you today. I don't even know where to start. These cats, you've definitely seen them in the streets because they're definitely up. Been. They definitely started from the bottom, been working their way up to the top. They didn't have no one really to teach them, but they decided one day to start writing graffiti, and they put this crew together. And the name of their crew is RGK. We got motherfucker Reject in the building, Doer, Herc, and Tragic. Young Tragic. Young yeah, RG. Hell yeah, what's good with you fellas? Yeah, not much, good. brother. Just out here grinding. I appreciate it, man. Thank y'all for coming, man. Because, like I said, I was telling y'all earlier, man, y'all names have definitely been coming up in the graffiti podcast. When you know we talk about who you be seeing up in the city, who be doing their thing, <laughs> you always hear RGK. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've, I've been hearing that. that. I was going over a couple of podcasts. Shout out, to whoa! Shout out to the homies giving love. Yeah, you know, for sure, respect. For sure. And man, I definitely see you everywhere. You know what I mean? You guys got bangers running. You know what I mean? Tags yeah. everywhere. Fucking doing doing y'all fizzle, man. For sure, appreciate it, bro. We always saying. Man. Y'all been staying busy in the winter, or what? Y'all taking it a little easy, or, or what's up? <laughs> Lately, bro. Yeah, I have. But 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 you know, back in the day, a couple couple winters, you know, that's the time to go. Sometimes you know, it the is. streets are dead and you're snowing. You know, catch a drywall. No, you know the cops ain't getting out chasing. Just don't you. use that silver because it ain't yeah. gonna dry. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you're sitting there for an hour or two. <laughs> you can smoke a blunt, a couple cigarettes. For sure, for sure. Know? And then it might be dry. <laughs> Maybe. You know what I'm saying? 20, 30 minutes later, you're sitting and waiting. For um, real, for real. That's just too, too funny, man. So let's kind of st- let's start at the beginning, man. How did RGK kind of start? Can you talk? Can you guys talk about that? Yeah, for sure, man. <clears throat> you know, it started. Uh, Originally, we started as Ruthless Graffiti Kings, you yeah. know, a bunch of group of group of the homies, you know, always chilling, partying together, you know. Uh, it was back in the day. Uh, you said y'all were partying, right? Like not just like fucking. Yeah, yeah. 2014, down. you know. Originally, we're just, you know, Money's it was ra- rave clothes. rave cruiser back yeah. in, you know, hitting raves, you know, getting fucked up with the homies and, you know, partying, you know, pulling bitches and, you know, having fun. And then uh, that's when we started seeing graffiti going up, you know. So who were you kind of seeing at the, at the beginning when you guys kind of were seeing shit? Uh, originally, when I was a, I was a youngster, you know, back back when it was originally, you know, originated, you know, with uh, Big Bro Taunt, you know, the Big Bro Praise. Shout out to them, yeah, you know, shout out. Shout out get it get shout it to them, and that's that's the originally started it, and but like uh, we we started watching, you know, War Four, you know, oh, yeah. get, that Some was back, shit, huh? yeah, back then mm-hmm. that was the real. Real deal, you know, like damn, these dudes are getting it in. That's something we don't do, but I like it, you know. Yeah, for sure. So, uh, you know, we we started picking up paint too. We started jumping, jumping in, and hitting the books, you know, seeing what's good, falling in the game, you know. Right. Meeting other bombers, you know, and and that's where we originally started. Just started like. We were originally just homies, just like kicking, partying. And like you said, you guys really didn't know anything about graffiti or about crews or anything. You just kind of were a bunch of homies that decided to start the shit between y'all, right? Yeah, yeah. brotherhood. Kind of self family. Right? Yeah. Yeah. It's all love. You know? yeah. 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 A lot of family. Yeah. A lot of family involved in the group. Are y'all like related or are y'all just like from the same, like, uh, you know what I mean? You know, a lot of, lot of, lot of blood, a lot of blood brothers, but too. A lot of RG. But we all family but, uh, in one definitely way. Definitely family. Know, it doesn't matter. And then ran along a lot of homies and then we just put, you know, put. Started, everybody started getting down, getting put on, and we built a brotherhood and a bond. And That's what it is, bro. It was Basically a weekly a brotherhood. to daily thing, and then we started painting and getting fucked up, hitting the clubs, hit, getting some walls. And you said like 2004, trouble. right? Yeah. So, I mean, you guys have definitely been around for a minute, right? Yeah, bro, for sure. We're, we're the underdogs on a lot of a lot of when we started off, you know. And You guys definitely have come a long way, though, you know what I mean? Definitely up, you know what I mean? For sure. The whole thing is, like we talked about earlier, just you got to at least getting better, you know? Oh, yeah, yeah definitely. You definitely. can't do the same shit bro. for fucking 10 years. No, hell no. Yeah. Yeah. Keep going shit on up. with the, the, the same shit, you know? Mm-hmm. Like, it, it gets Some repetitive. Fools do. Shit gets old, bro. I think that it does when it gets <laughs> yeah. old. For real. It becomes like, wasteful. You know? 
and it just it's tiring. You know what I mean? That dude sure. shit looks like the last Starting. dude shit. Yeah, man. Let's see After something different. You want to progress. You know what I mean? You want to definitely been evolving in the game. Flip it. You know, from starting off and uh, you know, just literally what it was is just when we started off, it was just it was a lot of tag banging. Mm-hmm. You know, we, that's what it was. Is that what you guys kind of started out as? We did. You know, a lot of us came from a different bunch of hoods, and then uh, you know we we became tight, became a brotherhood, became a family, and like family, we created created R G K. You mm-hmm. know, ruthless, and, ruthless graffiti kings. Where was everyone from? You said like the West, right? A lot of us were from the West. Started off originally from the West. Um, Should we got homies from the North? You know. Mm-hmm. Should, from homies from the east, all all parts of Colorado, you know, and mm-hmm. and they just you know a lot of outcasts, but a lot of a lot of riders, so the big hearts, you know, and and they felt perfect for RG, and that's that's where they we we found a home with each other. Rejects, you know, yeah, some rejects of Denver, you know what I mean. So that's shout right. out to Colorado's the home team, you know. Mm-hmm. Shout out to all the hoods from everywhere. We show love to mm-hmm. everybody. Shout out to all the know. crews out there with us. Oh, but, for uh, sure. And then, like you said. The one thing though about RGK is you guys have always kind of got a bad rap. Yeah, for sure, bro. We're like you know, people don't really know or, or kind of like you know what I mean. They always there's a lot of assuming going on. Is that am I right? A lot of assumptions. assumptions you yeah, know, but nobody, I, I like to look at my brothers as good men, good mm-hmm. dudes. You know, and I, you know everybody has their opinions, but uh, one thing that we do is we hold each other down. So yeah, we handle. We let people think what they do. You know but, what I mean? Like, period. There's a lot of talk going on. A lot of haters. A lot of a lot of other shit that people don't really know mm-hmm. but they took the time to really to inquire talk to about us it or like talk you know to mean? us and holler at us the people us. that have they they know what's up the people that have inquired about some shit and holler at us they know they're real tight to us you know yeah. mm-hmm. they're the people we hold close to us you know it's just we definitely be getting people in. that don't know they don't know shit so. right cause definitely be getting more in the, uh, involved in the graph scene you know mm-hmm. we're always like the outcast of that but like getting more involved in the uh, art galleries you know so Taking it to the next level, like we said, because we're growing. Exactly. You know what I mean? Exactly. Our first show was at the Be Good Dispensary. It was Deck the Hall. Shout out to Pisto. Oh, yeah. Held that one down. My board sold. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. Shout yeah, out to everyone season. after that. It was sad it wasn't this year, but it's all cool. Oh, yeah. I'm always looking to advance. and All my bros know. I leave the door open for them. You know what I mean? I put a rock in the door, and they could come in whenever they want. Hell yeah Always. And you guys were talking about You guys kind of migrated From like the west Up to Thornton And start kind of Fucking around up there huh? What yeah, year was that? It was about We didn't really get Popping until about uh, 2015, 2016 You know uh, uh, That's when uh, We really started You know Started hitting the streets And we started having You know Our crew meetings And you know Getting serious about You know mm-hmm. Let's let's If we're gonna paint You know Let's make it look nice You know Fuck You know the little shit. Let's let's go start hitting some big shit. You know, putting on. You know, and that's when we really got involved in getting paint. You know, the big shit. Uh, All right. Got the got involved in racking. You know, we were like, damn. You know, like let's get it. You know, and then yeah. we just started taking over. And it, it became it became easy of, to us, bro. Yeah, and racking is, though, like we ain't and never then, we ain't never thought about paying for paint. You know? <laughs> yeah. Right. Never, However that came, we just got it. You do you, do you mind if I ask like kind of how you get it? Do you just like go rack paint or do you like rack other shit? Because there's so um, many. Anything. Just, you know, anything. We need it. We mainly, uh, you know I mean? mainly uh, I'm a bucket dude or, uh, or, uh, or, Dollar or a cart. You know, yeah. nah, I'm, I'm getting my resto gang. You know, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I don't like doing up, shit for nothing. Uh, you feel me? I'm going to get like a honey honey 20. Yeah. I got a big ass tote. I've hit, big ass I got 500. When you say tote, you're talking about a big ass bag, right? Yeah. No, I'm no. talking about a big ass, oh, big ass okay. husky, oh. husky totes. Husky totes. Yeah. Yeah. The 150 yeah. gallons. Putting 50 it, gallon, it, putting it in the buggy, yeah. filling it up, and going. Bro, you know, it's just. We're walking out three of us at the same time. Yeah, that's a lot. I've been on plenty of missions. Three of us at the same time. Like, you ain't gonna stop us all. Like, good luck, you know. But have you ever had anyone kind of like giving everybody the secret? Oh yeah, I've been on plenty of missions to go rock and and I've had plenty of homies. Run security, so me and my nigga yeah. get out with what two bucks. What do you mean buckets. by run security? Like distract them or? Nah, nah they run in the workers. door. They let us through. Yeah, we got some workers that, you know, the humble. Shout that's out to them. That's a lot of info. <laughs> 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 yeah, I'm like, oh, it's <laughs> oh, <laughs> <man. laughs> all right. Yeah. Shout out to the homies. Inside yeah. man. Yeah. Yeah. My, my thing has always been having just the inside, bro. Like, yeah. you know what I mean? Having fucking someone that works for the airlines, so I don't know, I can get the cheap flights. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah sir. Sure. When you got it, we need that plug. So I'm a hookup no matter what. You know what I mean? It's all about hookups. Straight up, that's how it be. You know, you gotta have the connections. For sure, for sure. If you ain't from the hood, you ain't obviously. 
promise you don't have a hookup for sure. Bro. No, and, and plus cards, we got those. We do yeah. have. Oh, yeah. All day. Yep. Let, me, let me know what you got. Yeah. You got 200? I got 100 for you. All oh, I got day. you. you I got you, big Joe. You know what I'm saying? Hey, it's getting nice out, like you said, so for let's real. run it. You're going to see us in this, doing our barbecues for sure, bro. Some steak. We're going to invite you, bro. For real. Appreciate it. We'll get down on the grill, bro. We're a big family, so like I said, we get together, we grill, we eat, we drink. We we'll paint. Hey, we'll get y'all nice. Can run it to the next know. cookout for sure. For Bring sure. Hell yeah! Can't wait! Can't wait! Hey, so you guys said you guys kind of started off as like tag bangers, but now you don't consider yourself. You guys are graffiti, like a graffiti crew, right? You kind of yeah. like artists. You artists. know what I mean? For sure, we you definitely. Sp- uh, I feel like we definitely <laughs> stepped the the next level. You know, uh-huh. uh, we've worked our way up. We fought our way up. We've had plenty of beef. You know, if you're from Denver, Colorado, you know, you know that. But. Mm-hmm. uh we don't even like I said. I don't like to label us up as that. We, my brothers are good dudes. We hard work them in, and hey, we, we paint, we get it in, bro. Just yeah, like everybody else. You guys put in work, man, for sure. Know? That's definitely gone. Yeah, you know, and, and now we're taking it to the next level. You know, shout out to the boys in the crew, getting in those, uh, those galleries. You know, hitting those canvases. You know, putting in that work. You know, not only on the street, but shout like I said, getting into the everyone. art scene. So it's cool. <laughs> Right. We got some killers, my nigga. Shout out my nigga, bro. Shout out my nigga. Yeah. Yeah. Who are some of the homies in your crew that, that couldn't make it, man? Um, uh, Hijack, Bree, uh, my brother Sage. You know, Sage. You know, I can name them all, but uh, big praise. Yeah. Who are some of like your OG hitters, like in the crew, like not to put? You know what I mean? Like who um, really a lot of people who that have been every night painting. A lot of people who are active. Not does that shit. Uh, recently in the crew, like you know, we always shout out each other. You I'm know, still, I'm still, I'm still. You know, uh, I'm still making my way downtown. You know, uh, my boy Herc's been getting it in, doer. You know, uh, praise. You know, tragic. I even see Young Tragic putting young in tragic, work. You know, tragic. he's on everything though. He's on everything. He's doing a lot. He's out on the streets. Yeah, he's on everything. Multitasking. Yeah. He's getting it. I've been, uh, you know, I've been, I've been. We're not gonna name the other tasks. I've been sitting back, letting the boys get it in, but I love seeing the crew up. You know, yeah. You know, they're they're hungry. They're getting it. What kind of what kind of each of y'all what kind of has inspired you to do graffiti, man? We'll start with you, Hurt. Um, my uncle used to be a part of that crew back in the day. Um, he used to hit up T Risk, and uh, he used to send my my mom's prison letters in hand styles. So as like a youngster, I had to like decrypt that and uh, like for her. Then I started to realize that's that's graffiti. Was this some sick ass like? Hand it was style, it was bro? sick, like, bro. It was sick. It was like that Kelly style. You know what I mean? Like that's that's what I call it. You know what I mean? And anytime you see my hand styles, like when I'm really focused and shit, and the shit's real boxed out. You know what I mean? You'll see that in me. But uh, yeah, my uncle. Shout out my uncle. R.I.P. Did you ever have any like influences besides your uncle? Mm. Well, I ain't trying to be. Like that dude, but definitely like uh, well, my brothers, you know. Mm-hmm. Um, it was uh, see my the the foods that I got on with, you know, this crew basically, you know. Shout out to Coz too, you know. That's the king of the city, you know. Everybody knows what's up, you know. For I sure. looked up to it. If you see my spots, you know they're hidden just like he has his back in the day. But like uh, those mainly was uh, the cut, huh? It was in the cut, bro, and the buff couldn't find it. I mean. They already passed it by the time they realized it, you know. Exactly. But uh, yeah, definitely shout out to my the older cats that came from my own crew. That's why I joined my crew. Like I tell everybody, I was a fan of my crew, and that's why I joined it. And I've been riding ever since. And I ain't gonna change that up. Hell yeah, yeah. hell yeah. What about you, man? What was your kind of inspiration to start writing graffiti? So, uh, like I said, I was a young buck watching my big bros uh, taunt and praise, you know originate the crew you know putting on and then they you know one day i seen them evolving in you know party crew into uh graffiti you know and so i picked it up i was i was a young buck in the basement hitting the black book right just, uh the, the watch, cat hanging wa- out with yeah the older cats, yeah you know watching I mean? war four you know mm-hmm. f- figuring out my name you know came up you know reject one you know rgk i wanted to be a vandal bro i wanted to be that dude so like i like the hand styles to be originated, you know, I liked walking streets. I walked everywhere, you know, to and from school, everywhere, you know, and uh, wrote on everything. What was your marker choice, man? Uh, crank. I like mops. I like drippy shit. I like making a mess. You know, I like doing it big and letting it be seen. Uh, 
Yeah, basically uh, Phillies. I started getting into <laughs> Phillies, long hand styles, you know. Those are tight as NM, fuck. You know, I watched, I watched uh, NM videos on him and uh, actually just met him when he came into town. Hell That's yeah. what's up. So it was a big, uh, big, uh, you know, I was like, hell yeah. Met Smoke my favorite. We, we did. We hit a joint together. He was a cool ass dude. And uh, that's where I just wanted to go. I just started hitting shit and then I started hitting bigger shit. Got the straight letters in, started working on my hand styles, my, my letters, and that's that's the bomb I am, you know, just trying to get up street side. Hell yeah, that's the way you got to do it, man, you know what I'm saying? Yes, sir. What's up with you there, doer, man? What was your kind of inspiration to start doing graffiti, or what kind of got you into it? Shit, I'm a, honestly, I'm, most, I'm the most recent put on, you know mm-hmm. what I mean? Like, I, I met Praise first. Mm-hmm. And he was a big inspiration for me. Like I was, uh, I was out here. Uh, I was doing my own little thing for right. a little bit. You know what I mean. And then I met Praise, and he was like, "Bro, you could be, you could be bigger than that." You know what I mean. And I was already looked because I was by myself. You know what I mean. I was You're in just a dark rolling place. Solo, solo or what? Yeah, I was by, I was in a dark place. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean. I was already. I, I just fought some big ass shit that was going on in my life. Some you know what I mean. I took care of some shit and. Just Pray. drained your ass. He kind of came in and he was like the older brother that I needed. You know what I mean? He mm-hmm. was like, I act down love. He came in and he showed me like, what he basically just told me, what the fuck you doing? You know what I mean? And just put me on a started pain. Started paying more. Started getting better because I was already <coughs> paying. Mm-hmm. But he showed me what pain really was. You he know what I mean? Took you to and, the next level. Yeah, and they just kind of I just grew from there. Like once I met him, I met, I met, reject. I met hurt. I met. You know, my boy Breed, you know what I mean? Shout like, out Breed. Shout out Breed. You know, I, I met everybody that I met throughout the crew, you know what I mean? It's just always built me into the person that I am. And that's why, that's why my style is the way it is now, you know what I mean? Because right. I've been pushed so much by everybody to grow. And that's what your homies got to do, bro. They got to push you and help yeah. you elevate, you yeah, know what exactly. I mean? If your exactly. team ain't elevating yeah, like, you, it ain't yeah. shit, honestly. <laughs> And then yeah. you got to put in the work, or me, you know what I mean? Anyone, we got to take what they're giving us and kind of put it in and put it in and perfect that it, shit. It became a point where I was I was doing so much, I was pushing my own homies in the crew. And I I, I kind of loved that because then we all was getting out. We was killing shit. That's when we started hitting. Uh, it just became... That's it, when it, everybody it was hitting the throwing, bro. Guru. And, like, yeah. we had people stepping out that wasn't even stepping out before. All the shit where people were here. Yeah. It, it was, it was, it was so it cool. And, like, I, I, I don't know. After everything, like, I, I, met, I met everybody. It's Like I said, we big-ass family. Yeah, you we know grew. I mean? Like, we all... I love this guy. We all love, love this each guy. other. You know what I mean? Guy. Like, it's like, no matter what, like, if we in, in any type of predicament, Anytime. call anybody. Right. You know what I mean? No matter what it is, we can talk. Call me, you need some, three in the morning. Pick you that's up. a Whatever real ass brotherhood, yeah, bro. For real. None of that here. bullshit, like yeah. that. Yo, nah, that's a real ass brother. We ride for each other, and that's that's what I see between a lot of foods. Like, I, I feel like a lot of crews nowadays they'll they'll bail on a homie. Like, mm-hmm. we'll stand next to, and we'll get our ass whooped together. You know what I mean? Oh, for sure. If it's if we're outnumbered up. and there's four against two. Me and my boy know, like, we're going to stand there and get our ass whooped. Or we might whoop these foreign fools together. You never know. Right. You never know. You know what I'm saying? That's but the thing, though. For damn sure, know. we ain't going to leave them, like, empty-handed. You know what I mean? That's the type of... That's, this, this is a brotherhood, bro. It ain't even a crew. It's like... We say it's a crew. This is a family. Like, I, I have these boys around my kids. Like, you know what I mean? These mm-hmm. are my boys. They call them uncles, you know? Like, no, for sure. That's, that's, that's what we on. That's the type of tip that we on. That's dope, man. That's dope. What's going on there, young tragic? Not much. <laughs> We're kind of, I'm high as fuck over I'm here, man. Yeah. Yeah. We got pretty much the cost of that apple fritter. Yeah. What, what kind of inspired you? What kind of got you into graffiti, man? The only inspiration I ever had was my big cousins. I'm the youngest RG, so I always looked up to my big cousins. These are my big cousins. Oh, okay, for, for real, sure. For real. Yeah. And that's all I ever seen, like as a family and shit. Go to family things and shit. And definitely RGK. You know, my big brother is RGK. I've seen him. My big brother, Urge, Urgent. My big brother, Rest. Shout, shout out, out Urge, bro. Out we haven't even. Shout, shout out, out Urge. Shout out Rank. Shout out all. Shout out Rank. Shout, shout out Big out. Rank. I, I ain't seen no other. I ain't seen no other graffiti niggas except for RGK. So that's all I knew. Whether it was graffiti or whether it was beating niggas up, whether it was getting in the streets. Like, that's all I ever knew. And my brother was the first one to 
show me graffiti. I used to see his name all over the house, like in black books and on, the, on our trash can, like on the fridge and shit. Like right. my brother would write his name everywhere. And like I never really got it too deep into it, but I always knew my cousins is the same thing, you know. So my big cousin Praise, he's my oldest cousin. He put me on. To, he put me on to this shit. He put this shit in my head. So whether it's everything, everyday thing or not, this graffiti shit's man, though, shit's a lifestyle for real. Family thing Most for real. No, for sure, for sure. I heard that. And hey, when you first started off, what were you, you know, what were you kind of running with? Were you just running with tags or? I was just running with tags and just like I said, I'm the youngest RG, so barely around like 2000, like what. Like, 18, I just barely started, you know, so mm-hmm. we'd hit tags, we'd fuck around with the can, just with whatever, but I liked doing throwies and shit, those were cool, I wanted to learn those for sure. Is that what you're kind of doing right now, is yeah. that what you do now, more throwies, yeah. or what's your kind of like specialty right throwies now? Throwies and hollows. Okay. Street side. Yeah. Hell yeah. Always. All up on feds and shit. Feds is a spot, bro, that's one thing. All up on feds, all up on You always gotta get That old school, you always gotta, gotta hit feds. That old school. Yeah. 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 The night before. Federal yeah. Boulevard, yeah. Colfax. Like, 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 did that yeah. shit, bro. The thing like, about us, bro, we used to have meetings and, uh, you know, shout out to the crew fucking shout coming through, you know. Uh, we're, we're real Mando, you know, real real structure. We got real, uh, real structure at one point, and we are, that's how we are today. You know, mm-hmm. that's why we're. Show up or. But, uh. You know, get some get some get some streets at some certain days. You know, was mandatory. You know, and you know we like to do it like old school. I I was young and cruising feds and seeing the hang downs, and so I was like, let's get some hang downs, let's get some throwies, let's get some straight letters. You know, because you know, bomb real, it. Real quick, you said at first to get an RGK, you had to get jumped in, right? Yeah, and even I got jumped in. Even I had to go through that too. And this is my family. Even though you're you know? the cousin. Yeah, yeah, I got my whole family. I put my, my own cousin. brother on, so yeah. it, it's just how it goes. You know? hey. My big brother and Tough my big love cousin. Sometimes, you know? Tough love it. It's not even like that. Iron it, it's, sharpens it's iron. Really, it's like, all right, we're really just testing you. Like, what are you gonna do if? If something does go down. Something yeah. does go down, and you know what I mean? You so low. Are you going to ball up? Yeah, you're yeah. Gonna, yeah. Are you going to be so Like, yeah. we can't have that. It's just hard. You know, it's, it's, hard. it's just hard in the long run. Yeah. It makes it's just, it's just, it's just, it's just it, something it's just we've done for the longest through. time. For, so, you know, it was just like I said, back in the party days, what it originally was, we'd get fucked up. But, you know, this we're a bunch of knuckleheads. We're a bunch of knuckleheads. So we just bad that. We're all some rejects, you know what I mean? Exactly. So they over here trying to act like they're some nice guys and shit, like they're so nice and this and that, but not really. <laughs> they be like super nice. Yeah, they be uh, they acting real hey, super nice, like, like good yeah. gentlemen and shit. No, nah, but yeah. fucking, if we really want to put on a video right now of how it used to be, like I just, you know, old Shit's video on YouTube, around right? seven years ago, Shit. fucking, like an RGK is. put on. There's one on the video right now. My niggas over here acting like some nice men and shit, but. Again, those two. Gang for real. We are yeah. ruthless. We got, but we got to. We're, we're, you know what I mean? But with, yeah, the, with being, you guys, I mean, you know, we're ruthless, but you've grown and taken it to a different level. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah, we always be ruthless, and that's what it's going to be, brother. That's the brand, that's the name, that's the logo. Mm-hmm. You know, but, the, but we always, uh, like, I'm, I'm telling the big, the little bros, you know, mm-hmm. let's evolve, let's get this money. Not for let's sure. Let's come up. Mm-hmm. You know, let's build an we're at another level where, uh, mm-hmm. you know, I've killed the streets, you know, from, uh, from, from every part of Colorado, bro. So, you know, it's like, let's get this bread now. I can merge that sure. too, because even though my big brother put me on, my big cousin, this nigga who showed me graffiti for real. Mm-hmm. So I learned all that shit way before, but this nigga showed me alleys and shit. He took me to where it's really at, and that's where I learned a lot of my shit out. He took me to rooftops. Like, you know, kind of pulls, kind of climbing little pulls like that, bro, <laughs> with a big ass backpack full of paint for on real, your shit. Huh? Yeah. Hey, see, sometimes you gotta get to the spots. You gotta Sound get to them. Hey, get to them. Yeah. I, I, t- I tell you what, dog. One time they made me get on this roof, and this shit was sketchy as fuck. But it was like one of those ladders, like that's kind of way up. And I'm a fat motherfucker, bro. So like, <laughs> you know what I mean? Uh, like, yeah, we kind of uh, shimmy some it, shit. It, it's just, bro, yeah, I stay on the ground. I know exactly bro. what you're talking about. Uh, hey, shit you know off the ground, man? I stay on the ground. I know exactly what you're talking about. We're here. We yeah, can't take it up. I'll, I'll stay watch, bro. Fuck that. I ain't going up there. They know it too. We're going out. I was like, yeah, the homie. Got down and he's like, step on my back. And I was yes. like, Are you sure, yeah. fool? I'm this. And I made it up there and made it back down. <laughs> my but then that shit was. I'd be like, Let's goon. go, brother. You could do hey, it. I got a motivation, boy. Bro, like, if, if you don't believe it, this will hold good. me up. 
this fool's holding me up, and I'm a big dude, bro. Like, like step on my shoulders. Like, got you hurt. Don't even trip. I'm like, I'm a big, I'm a big hey, dude, bro. fam. Like he's like, I got you. Don't even. We, gotta we, we get in here. Bro. Like we, we ain't never leaving each other, bro. We, we all you. getting out. We going in there together. We getting out together, bro. They never left me. Huh? Even my big ass, they'll throw me over that fence, bro. I swear. I hate climbing fences, bro. Hey, I'm cutting through it now. The poles. Done with it. Already, I'm done. I'm cutting through it, bro. So the poles are what me. Like us, I went out with a. Shout out to uh, Disabled, bro, f- you know, from Cali. When he came out here, we hit this uh, this this billboard, and it was, I, you know, I paint heavy. I've been painting for a while. I've caught some good spots. I, you know, but this pole we, we climbed up was, it, it, it didn't end. And I was looking down, and I was like, oh, fuck, I'm, I'm way up here. I'm too high. High as fuck. You know, was, and then when I got up on the billboard, you know, that shit's fucking swerving, and you're up there just... I'm grabbing onto the metal trying to fill in my shit. Like, yeah. Sketched as hell. Drunk. <coughs> you know, I'm like looking Where was down. This at? It was like on Colfax in Colorado on this on this nice billboard. Uh, uh Escape from B C. Shout out to him, the homie next to me, and then mm. Disable from Cali. We all went out and hit that night. It was it was a good night. Killed some shit. Dude's a savage. Nice, but, nice. Uh, it's yeah, good paint night shit. Kept up with the yeah, yeah. We, killed, we killed it. We killed it, bro. Showed them that Denver style, you know. We killed some shit. I've been in fucking Cali and had to roll with what they do, bro. Oh yeah, That's bro. Just wild yeah, yeah. I hear about I, that, bro. Yeah. Hey. I gotta step up, homie. We gotta go. Hey, hey, it's another, it's there. another level out there, bro. And, hey, another story I have there. out there in Cali, bro. Put some in your step. You know what I mean? Step, because we checking everyone first of all, and this is on some different shit. You know what I mean? Shout out to the homies in Cali. That's what I'm gonna tell you. The one good thing about Cali, bro, is like for big fools, like everywhere has a, a hole cut. Like yeah. every place to every highway, to everything. Like the homies jump the fence, like just cross the street, right there. There's Hit a that hole, hole. Do went down the highway. Fuck and, yeah. You know what I mean? So there's holes everywhere, everywhere for everything. Uh, <laughs> you set. Much, you know what I mean? Uh, <laughs> shit, let me go over there. Then I don't want no trouble fucking jumping. On we got fence. some homies out in Cali, the yeah, RG no. branch out there. Right. You know, that's what we got. Do you guys right have like cats, like homies in other spots? Yeah. Or? Uh, what when the internet like came up? That's when we discovered everything. We obviously. We're a, we're Colorado's home team, so we've been here, stabled, you know, set up here. Once the, the internet man, yeah, the popped off, shit. then we like Super. hashtag RGK graffiti, and then you find whoever the fuck you need to link up. Obviously, so super crazy. We got a crew out in like Paris, oh, cool. France, bro. RGK, shout out to them. Yeah, shout, out to shout, shout out to them. Yeah, Nezzy. Ah, nice yeah. is in the house. They're offering him a shot of some. Yeah, yeah. Nice. nice is Casamigos. in the house. He's been sipping that Casamigos with us. Yeah. He knows what's good. Nice high tight. Chill the cup. Looks like security, actually. Looks he like does look like security. Looks like the principal or the teacher right now. Yeah. <laughs> like, we're supposed to be doing this as, like, yeah. a they, they assignment they or right something. Like, uh, you know, we're going to go hit a spot after. Yeah, yeah we're yeah, definitely going to hit a spot. He's right now. I see what I see what he's doing. He said, on that note, I'm going to get the fuck out of here. Yeah, you know. Fucking. Yeah, I heard that. Let's go hit a spot after this. Let's go. Yeah. Have to see what's up. <laughs> yeah. Whenever you let's go. Board, it's super sweaty. I'm just, hey, I'm super like, sweet. I'm good. You know I'm out. You know my ass is out. Hey, he said a billboard that's I'll super sweet. I get up there, get up there but that. I can say I ain't gonna be bitching. You know what I mean? Shit. Shit. If, if if Joe Thunder's rolling with us, me and him gonna be on the ground smoking yeah. some weed, hey, watching y'all sway. Hey, trust yeah, me, you want the RGK niggas with you? Yeah, we the lookouts. Yeah, we the lookouts. Too big, but that shit when I got up there it was so windy. It was. Whew, I, I thought I was I was so close to the thing. I had white all over my jacket. I'm good. Got it. Sometimes, you know, you get a little nervous. You got to gotta handle the shit. The higher up, the worse, too. Shit. Exactly. Exactly. Shit. But y'all uh, gonna start seeing this more. And definitely, we can start hitting them. Oh, when summertime comes around, it's gonna be on. I think the whole city's gonna about to. It's gonna catch. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna snap. I'm not gonna say too much after that. Our but I'm gonna be snap. Line. Yeah, we're definitely gonna be front line. Shout out to all the crews that have been. You know, those are our boys here. Regardless, they show us love. We show them love. Keep that in mind. And that's what, what it's about. Because I was gonna say, you guys said that you've had tons of beef, but like. At the end of the day, you just what don't is want, beef? Yeah, you don't yeah. want beef. Like with Biggie anyone. said, what's we beef? We don't really want beef for nobody, beef brother. Really? We, like I said, um, I think it's just like on some jealousy shit, some hating shit. Some hating shit, man. I mean, just be real. I mean, um, to be real, like we're just out here doing what y'all doing, getting right. ups. You know, if you got a problem, we are, we're always down to. I think to I saw the Ellen. issue. 
Mm-hmm. Hey, Eller TKO was talking about Texas. He was saying, fuck side busting. Like, just, let's all get it in. Let's all fuck shit up. You remember that story? I kind of believe so. I think so. Eller TKO said that. He was saying, like, like in Texas or something, he's like, fuck haters thinking side busting is side button. Let's, let's all kill it. Let's make graffiti a fucking just straight killing shit. You know what I've been you hearing of that is, like, I've heard this from a couple people. That's why people are going bigger. You know what I mean? And taking all the shit up because motherfuckers will fucking pull some lame ass shit like that. You know what I mean? Not even like 24 hours after you do that shit. Yeah, yeah. man. That's usually how it goes. Yeah. Especially in, in Colorado. Like, we, we is a little small town. And it just sucks because, like, like I said, there's a lot yeah, of haters. we're a little square. You know what I mean? Like, we, we's a we're small a square. State, we got actually. a lot of haters. Like, I don't understand why people can't just get along. Yeah, like like you know I said, I mean? bro, we we uh, we like, we've had a fi- we've had you know a fix shit the next night. I fixed some shit the same night. The yeah, same. There's been times, literally. There's been times where I've actually paint. caught people crossing me out. Mm-hmm. Is you it, know, it's, now it's is it graffiti up. cats fucking your shit up, or is it kind of like more maybe gang shit? It's or more. It it's ball? more of these graffiti cuts. You it, know, it, you know, just you know, the hipster side. No names. No names, but no names, but you know, it's just it's more of a graffiti side. You know, we we are a graffiti crew. You know, there's not any other people. I I, I got I'm a businessman and in, in outside of graffiti and, and this and that, but nobody's nobody hates. Right. You know, it's just these people yeah. that uh, a certain group of people. Every time I'm gonna say it like this real quick. They fuck with us. That's what happens when you get up, bro, and you start smashing like fools, start hating, fools start trying to cross your shit out, go over your shit. You know, what it's I mean? gonna come with it. Talk it's in. gonna come with it. You just gotta get the mind yeah. folks to get out even more and bigger. And like, like I said, said shit guys been doing shit. There's been times where. Um, there's, shout out to the crews who actually have met up with us and squashed the beef, you know, man, you know, on, on some man shit. Real man. We've, uh, we met up and, and, we've had, and we've handled done. business and they it's been done, for themselves. you know, but, uh, we did but there's still these we'll other come. people in the dark and the, but that's always going to be but hating. You're always going to have a couple. You're always going to have those people in the like shadows. Said, the ones that are about anything are we're going to step up and hit you and be like, hey, exactly. homie, what's up? And that's yeah. going to get taken care of. The it's going to get taken care of. Do that shit on the sly or on the sneak and all that bullshit. That's, that's the shit that they're just gonna. They're just that's a hate. Parents, that's a I mean, hate and shit. Shout out to the internet. Yeah. Yeah. Shout out to the internet for ruining Instagram. Instagram. The Instagram. Real world. Instagram. Yeah. Instagram. You know. Insta writers. <laughs> but I mean, fucking, it's good to hear that you guys ain't trying to beef with no one, man. Like you know, what I mean? yeah. it's not worth it. It's not. It ain't. It's not. It really ain't. A lot of headaches, a lot of waste of paint, like we were talking. Major about. headaches. Mm. We're on another Especially level right now. Especially when you're doing a big ass. We're getting money. Yeah, and all these fools want to keep tagging your shit. All this shit. We trying to. We trying to build. You know what I mean? Like I said earlier, an, we trying to build an empire. Because yeah. outside of all this graffiti shit, mm-hmm. they ain't who they look like. They are on the wall. Right. Period, no. point blank. They ain't doing nothing. Nah, they're we try not. To, we trying to make sure we're straight, too. So we Because we out here. And if you, and period. You know what I mean? We already we did all that. We, we already did all you niggas, and we still doing it. Like, I watched all these niggas do all these niggas, and we still doing it. We doing some other shit now, though. We up. Hell yeah! Multitasking. Man, hey, let me ask you about this because you guys have seen and been seen graffiti for like the last ten years. You've seen it kind of here, and then it went away. You know, like people take <laughs> I don't know, people take breaks, then it kind of came back. I want to say kind of start coming back when le- we got le- legalized. Because you start, yeah. we start getting people from out of town, okay, huh? and then a couple other you know people from in the city start kind of doing their thing and actually inspiring. Like, yeah, for honestly, sure. Inspi- inspiring yeah. who though? Inspi- you know what I mean? Inspiring who because I remember when Denver before weed was legal, mm-hmm. Denver was still getting bombed the fuck up. I mean, war war is a video footage of Denver getting bombed the right. fuck up, killed before people started smoking weed, dog. So like I just who- feel like it took a I just feel like it took a break. I'm not saying the people from, no, from I outside you out. inspired Definitely. us. I'm saying there were actually a couple oh, okay, people okay. in the okay. cities that decided to start getting them and then yeah. inspiring the whole well, city. Yeah. It's like it who did but, you know, the whole city, but like I'm, 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 some of the I don't, I don't know. know. It is, it is. I love the vandal- what I, see, I love vandalism, yeah, man. I love, I love the and I don't shit. like because I, mean? I see a lot of these cats. You know, you could tell when they get caught up because all their graffiti slows the fuck down. One thing you know about I mean? us is you I've always tell seen my bros there. always getting it, mm-hmm. but like I've always seen some people like coming in doing it bigger, and I'm like, oh shit, they hit that spot like real big. We could have done that. I mean, we're we're Vicious. we're Denver like bombers, and yeah, we're getting it in weekly, daily, but. You know, even if we took advantage of the of the slowdown of oh, everything. Sure. So the the weed, the COVID, 
we definitely took advantage of everything. I think everybody. Did. And uh, we took advantage of the racking, the painting. Mm. We went super hard. I will definitely say that COVID kind of helped that shit out for real. Because the motherfuckers, first of all, they had nothing to do. Nothing. And like you said, I mean, yeah, you can wear a mask. Yeah. Like people that like were robbing the fucking supermarkets the first time. Where's, your receipt? Where's your receipt? Just walking out. Yeah, just not even. Yeah. Your receipt? Wilding out. <laughs> uh, and then the cops were nowhere either. Yeah, because they couldn't yeah. tell snowboard. Really like I said, yeah, there's nights that were, you know, street sides, and, and they ain't. I, I, I was in, that's the, the, time the most I do is hit the lights on us, you know, chirp us. Mm-hmm. Yeah, not, not, we'll not, run not. off, you know, hide around the bush. We'll right. come back, right, right, finish right. our shit. Right Whatever we got to do to finish the shit. You know, shit, so right. it's just like, it wasn't It wasn't really, uh, it wasn't heavy. It wasn't a... Uh, no, they didn't know, give a fuck. They did not give they a fuck. They still kind of don't give a fuck. Yeah, yeah, I mean. It's just like, it's... There's even it's, but they got hey, other shit to worry about, for real. especially in yeah. the city. But I'm at that time, you, I feel like it was wild. Of the city, yeah, it's, it's a whole different story. They ain't got shit to worry about. You feel me? They, yeah. they on top of shit, so it's like a time and place. You know what I mean? Like you, that makes a lot of sense, though. Yeah, you know, yeah, for sure. That's just kind of it's slowly coming back, but I mean, they got bigger things like. Going to LA, they're like all they're worried about there is fucking guns and meth. Oh, you ain't bro, got no yeah. guns and meth. I visited LA blood. and uh, so I was painting street side out there and uh, I was catching a throwy and and some dudes. I had it was me and my girl. She was like, this car keeps rolling by and I'm like, oh yep. I'm like, I see you. Uh-huh. I don't know what time it is and you know we ain't we ain't got nothing out there. We're on vacation, so I'm like, fuck. They pull in the parking lot and. I'm just they, hey, they're real life essays out there. They, they're like, what's they're up, homie? I thought, essays. I thought you were fucking, <laughs> I thought you were said, fucking hey, going over my shit. I said, I'm, around, from, I'm from Denver, homie. I was like, I'm catching a, you know, empty spot. You know, I got my, my empty uh-huh. spot. You know, I wasn't going. Over. He's like, oh, you're good. You want to fucking smoke a joint? I was like, hell yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna watch your back, bro, cause it's hot around here. You know, I was like, no, for real, yeah. Bro. He's like, you holding? I was like, nah, bro. I'm literally fucking on vacation. He was like, I got you. I got you. you. you, got I got you. you. He was like, he's like, cause it's beef right here. We're going back and forth for this spot. And I was like, Damn. they rolled up on me like, what's up? And I was like, cool. They showed love. But you know, LA was cool, and I was ha- I was killing it. <laughs> but that's the only like, I was I was catching hot spots, you know. But they they rolled up on me. It was it was love though. It was like hell yeah, it's a cool vibe, bro. No, I know what you're talking about, bro. Cool vibe. When I was in LA, like it was some boys in the hood type of shit. Full like he was all sloss, and the homie was straight up like filming. And these motherfuckers, they see us, and they ain't they're bumping at first, and they ain't paying attention. And then they see us and they turn the music down. Yeah. And they do the U turn and then they come around this side and they start fucking revving. And my homie's like, well, let's just get out. And we like, they start coming and we just dipped. And it was like weird, dog, because this cop like came out of nowhere, too. So then it was like worried about the cops and the fucking. Yeah. I'm out. And we straight time to go. Austin and like in the hood, bro, like South Central, like fucking doing dumb shit. Nah, that's so you don't. It's wild. It's wild. Straight up, I ain't even playing. But the homies like dog, we bomb in the hood, bro. Like when we're in LA, we bomb. We don't. We bomb everywhere, but we we start off in the hood. For dog. sure, yeah, That's yeah. How it should be, though. Honestly, I'm about to go paying out there with y'all, bro. Straight <laughs> up, we gonna bro. have to step out. Shit, already, man. It's like a, it's a field day out there. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. But the thing about there is it's so hard, bro. You could do 20 throws, bro, and you're still not up. Nothing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Up I noticed that. Like it's, that. It's, These yeah. dudes Different are doing roller like, street but, side, you know. I, I can't like, wait. Damn, how do you I compare with wait. that? These dudes are rolling Those stress out. Hopes they kill out there. They be He's definitely putting shit. on. Yeah. Dude, when I went out there, like I seen him a lot. But then even like one of the things like is when you don't go certain places. Like I seen like a lot of L.A. And like I said, we're in the hood. So when I was going back to the airport, I'm going through Watts and Compton to get to the airport. Like you even see him even more, bro. Yeah, and I see TK. Big was rollers. In the hood. Yeah, like big ass. I was just like, damn. Like I ain't yeah. seen this like big part. out there. I feel that. Like, yeah. I mean, you know, they do their thing. Shout out to TK. You know, straight my boy uh, Clips and EK. You know, EK. cool as fuck. Clips. Hey, straight out. Clipsy, straight the homies. Right out. Out. Clipsy, EK. Yeah. Hell yeah. Much yeah. love. They show mad love, bro. Yeah. It's that sure. Denver life, you know. Yeah. Yep. It's yep. That Denver they life. They already know. And let's talk about though how you guys got your name and maybe your first name that you wrote, man. So you hurt. Um, what I wrote in the like in the beginning, I ain't, I ain't gonna talk to you like super toy. Obviously, <laughs> I ain't gonna talk too much about that. But what, I, was, what, yeah, what was I was bobbing in the back of like laundry mats when I was a kid. I ain't gonna talk about that name. You know what I mean? But uh, I got the name. <laughs> I was the laundry mat king, yo. If you see me, I was out there. You better watch your back. Laundry mat king. Um, <laughs> my mom's man. She was pissed. 
Uh, <laughs> but I got Herc off of like you know um, Hercules, you know uh, the Nutty Professor. I'll, I've always been a earlier, Hercules, yeah. Hercules, it, that's what Hercules. I'm saying, bro. Like when you said that, I felt like I was like I'm supposed to be here. Um, <laughs> but anyway, yeah, yeah it's, you know how it is. Being a big dude, you know, my auntie would say Hercules, Hercules, you know. And then uh, as a kid, it moved and developed to my favorite Disney movie. I know this is super corny, but I don't give a fuck. Uh, my favorite movie was Hercules. All right. You know, and I'm strong as fuck. I promise you that. I'll choke. Anyway. Um, <laughs> Just don't but, fuck with uh, me. So, like, they called him Herc, you know, in that movie. They mm-hmm. called him Herc for short. And I was like, yo, word. That, I like that. It, it was probably with a, not the way I spell it, obviously. It was with a C. But, you know, got to keep that that gang affiliation in there. So I put a K in there. And it's complicated, but it still looks good. There you go. That's all but they that's, need to that's know. That's where you know I got it from, man. Hell yeah! What Big about hurt, you? Though. What about you, there, reject? Shit, brother! I fucking started off hitting off uh, Aeon, bro. My brother, we were real close, so it was Aeon and Ion, you know. You know okay, uh, like kid and plays. Uh, you know, kid yeah, and plays. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, yeah. And then, uh, <laughs> and then, uh, <laughs> you know, they yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and then uh, we're fucked up in the basement one day, me and the homie, and he was like, "Bro, you should probably reject." And I was like, "Hey, let me start hitting it up." And I started, you know, it's R G K, just to. I've always been a reject, you know, okay. so I was like... Oh, so you kind of threw that into it. Yeah, so I was like, let's get it. I don't even got to hit up RGK no more. I could just hit up reject. <laughs> so uh, that's how I started hitting it up, bro. Found my name and started killing it. There you go, man. What about you there, Dewar? Dude! <laughs> um... Like the soldier boy, like where? <laughs> just I don't know. Shit, that we just—I just came up with that one. <laughs> like, dude, uh, dude. Uh, just boom. Hi. Right. You're on the beach, nice. What's up? You're nice. on the beach, keep it up, bro. Nice. Nice. <laughs> Trying to get some production out of nice yeah. beats over yeah. here. He's but he said, but the memo has been stone. Stone. Nice stone. He said that would be perfect. Oh, yeah. You could drop that fucking one of your beats, like, dude. That's good. Be I'm good weed. A little bit of consumer. Oh. That's why my boy Come is on, chilling. Man, we doing? Nice, he's up here being money, he's security too. I heard that. Hey, yeah, I'm he's busy. still security, bro. He's still security. Yes, I'm only getting paid to be security. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> he's, he's just being paid. He's not getting paid as a producer tonight, yeah, so bro. we're gonna have Everybody to work much. that out somehow. <laughs> Go for it, though, man. How'd nah, you... <laughs> yeah. Back to your question. So, um, I ain't even for the front. Like, I started young. Uh, it's it's kind of been around my uh my around in my life for a little mini. My uh my family. Knew some fools back in the day, you know what I mean? I kind of grew up with them, and I've always kind of watched it happen. And then uh, I met this other cat, and he kind of he kind of showed me what it was, you know what I mean? It was back in up like middle school, so I, I kind of always been around it, you know what I mean? Right. But uh, I got the, I got the name Young. I was like I was like 13, 14 when I got Dewar, and. Uh, this uh this older fool he used to just write names all day long just put letters together you know what uh-huh. I mean and he wrote it D W E R and I told him I was like hey that's just sick I'm gonna I'm a, I'm a, I'm gonna swap these letters by D E W R do it and it just kind of like I just I stuck with it forever do and it like does I it? do it what well, does it the does it part came later you know what I mean uh-huh. like it was just always do it you know I was active I was that that's how it was and then it like, I, you know what I mean is do or does it uh, alter ego do it uh, does it <laughs> not exactly no, nah, cause I don't. Like easy, I'm, easy I'm does just, it. Yeah, nah. they. Oh, hey, I heard hey. that, but no, no, no. I never good. even thought about oh, it like that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's trash. Right. Well, They'll pull your car. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Uh, that song. Oh, man. oh, we. <laughs> we better stop. Honestly, we'll yeah, put that song if you, on. If you really like, want, if you really think about it, yeah, I guess it would be an alter ego, cause I don't. I don't like. I don't like people to know who I am. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? That's just. That's just off. I should stop talk. You know what I mean? Like a lot of people do though. It's just what it is. Like Colorado, if they're lucky enough, they have met me and see my face. But other than that, like if you ain't never met me, you ain't never met me. But uh I don't know, like I got that name, like I said, when I was young and it just kinda grew, you know what I mean? And then I like I said, I, I started painting. I got in a little bit of trouble. And it, it, it I, I, I sat I sat it I ain't gonna lie, I sat in jail for a little bit. Man. And uh, that whole time I drew. 
You know what I mean? I just I did that name over and over again because it's just something that was in my head. You know what I mean? Yeah. For the longest, but I never felt like I was at my full potential in life. You know what I mean? That's honestly so like, I, like that shit. The hospital is the perfect time to do that straight shit. Straight out. So I drew, 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 like out the ass. You know what I mean? And then when it, when the time came, I just. It just happened, you know what I mean? Like I, I started hitting, cause I, 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 so I used to watch the little documentaries on YouTube, like mm-hmm. uh, uh, shout out KD, Kings Destroy, Coke Woo! Two, and all them, you know what I mean? Cause like that Kings Destroy documentary, that was a shout out. That was that was the blast for me. Once I seen that, it was a move. I was like, all right, I'm hitting like Coke Two, period. <laughs> you know what I mean? So That's I had to right. step out. Like, it was all the throwies. I love my throwy. That's what it is. Like, my throwies just wear that. Like, I progressed my throwy. I heard that. But, no, nah, either way, I, I, I progressed my throwy so long. You know, I started at one. And then, like, I changed it. I tried to try to change up my style and this and that. But I, I've always went back to the same to little the bubble. You know what I mean? Same like little bubble. But I, put, I, I progressed it. You know what I mean? So it was cool. It was, it was cool. Like, I just, once I, once I met RGK, like I said, my style progressed. And I went from this little I want to I don't want to say toy because I was a toy. Everybody starts as a toy. Correct, yeah. But I was I was doing this little simple bubble. Toy till further notice. You know what I mean? Just to make my little noise, little make 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 some noise, you know what I mean? Make my little name out there. Now did you get your throwy from somebody or did you do it your actual self? No, I, I, like I said I sat there I and sat there for a minute and there. just drew 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 drew. And it was like I said I only did throwies. That was my thing. Mm-hmm. I, I kind of wish I sat there and did pieces, you know what I mean? Because now I'm trying to build my piece, but I'm progressing. It is what it is, you know? Like I said, I'm building. But, uh... On some throwing shit, do you have... Is it black and silver? Do you have a couple of favorite colors? Nah, straight up. I ain't even from the front. I'm just a black and white person. White and black. However it go, you know? But if I also do like my reds and my whites, mm-hmm. my I do love my colors. Like my, my baby blues and my dark reds. Like, you know, I do I do fuck with them. Don't get me red. Mm-hmm. What, don't what, get me wrong. What what brand do you use, by the way? Oh, Sorry, okay. I don't mean to take over. My, my oh, boy knows what it is. It's called Rustos, period. Rustos. You know okay. Where do you get Rustos those gang. Rustos? You know I mean? No, but where do you get those Rustos, though? Hey, I can't be putting... I, we put no, but like, where do you... Obviously, you can't buy no Rustos anywhere. Y'all heard already. Y'all already heard. You know what I mean? But, uh... RG, Rusto Gang. Rusto Gang. Rusto Gang or Don't Bang. We put it in, but, uh... Yeah, no, we just, like... Once I met RG, I progressed, and I, my my throwy just became what it what what it is now. You know, I no, I think the throwy is the most important part, bro. You know what I mean? That's 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 what makes your name. Yeah, like you know, like I, I hit it a little. Yeah. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah, mean for sure. That's just that's just me. Straight, you know what I mean? Straight, I love yeah, it, sir, and I'm progressing. You. Like I just added. Like honestly, if I'm gonna tell you straight up, I just added. Uh-huh. <laughs> you know what I mean? Because I like that. You know, always, I'm he's to, on talk <laughs> like, <laughs> He's on look at this right here. You see this right here? I just added that. I just did that. That's the way it should be. So there should never be. Anything that's the same. I mean, yeah, you got to switch. Something got so twisted. I don't do the same yeah. thing every time. Like I don't know. My mind doesn't let me. Mm-hmm. I have I have really bad ADHD, and I don't know if that's why. Maybe I hit the way I hit, but like when I get in the zone, I'm mm-hmm. I'm moving. Yeah, you know what I mean. It's, it's, one, two, it's just like second hand. Like I just I learned. I progressed. Like my boy Hurt taught me how to do a little character. So like I got to look. Like I I told you earlier. I got if I needed to, we go do a little one letter. Nice. You know what I mean? I could do a little D with a little face on there, the hat and all kinds of He said the shit. face and the hat, hat and all. Hell yeah. Everything. Yeah. I ain't even fit front, but you know what I mean? If you've seen it, you've seen it, because I know it's out there. He's one or two. You know what I mean? If y'all seen it at some point, you know what I mean? But nah. Hell yeah, man. Hey, what's up, Tragic? How'd you kind of get your name, man? Explain. Uh, was that your first name, too? or? Nah, Tragic was not my first name. My first name was Groove. It was G R U V E, and that's just something I came with, came up with by myself, just doing whatever I was doing with my homies and shit. So, you know, it was grooving. But uh, my big cousin, he gave me his old name. Praise his old name used to be, you know, tragic, and he blessed it down to me because I'm his okay. little cousin. So Shout he, out praise. So he blessed his Shout name. Shout out down OG to tragic. And you know, the, OG tragic. You know, the tragic got the the R G K in it too. T R A. G-I-K, R-G-K. So, yeah. That's dope, man. What about you, man? What kind of what kind of like um, gets you going to kind of cause go out and do some graffiti, man? When I see my brothers getting it, when I see my brothers getting it, throwing a roll, every spot we get in, they're Ooh. setting up meets, they're setting up 
spots. <clears throat> just kind of staying active and, or- and organized. Like, kind of like you said, it's one thing to kind of let some shit just kind of go, whatever. But if you kind of let some put out a number, we're going to get, you know, 20 spots this week, you know. And trust me, I feel real comfortable with my brothers. And my brothers feel comfortable with me. And we feel comfortable together wherever we go. So wherever we go to go hit a spot, <clears throat> there's definitely our little cousins, our little... Their yeah. children, the future generation. You know, we got the cookouts yeah. going. Pass that, yeah. We there all day. Keep yeah. crew, bro. A little Hercules coming soon. That's what I'm He's saying. Too little, though. You know. The little families getting blessed in just like how I did. Did you get it? Oh, yeah. He's passing it to you, fam. Right. Yeah, yeah. He's passing it to you. Well, shoot. Yeah. We're gonna take Circle a little break. Right. Right. What the hell, Mary? Get some I drinks, roast some Yes, sir. I paid attention. You didn't hit the last one. Put your thumb up. Put your thumb up. Podcast. RGK. Y'all need to share the mic. Great stuff. All right, and we're back with the Smoking Joe Thunder podcast. Your boy Joe Thunder, and we're back with RGK. Took a little break, chopped it up a little bit. We got some more shit for you, man. So shit. So we was talking about earlier, man. Um, we was kind of talking about like beef, and um, one thing that sucks about beef is sometimes it can definitely be resolved easily. You know what I mean? Like, instead of, like, assuming and just going on and just fucking da-da-da-da, reaching out to a motherfucker and being like, hey, what's up? Like, you know what I mean? You got yeah, an issue, yeah. and then, you know what I mean? On some girl man shit, like, yep. And that's what we're, like, talking about. Like, a lot of shit could definitely be handled, you know, by making a phone call and meeting up. And honestly, one of the ways that graffiti writers, fucking, we've got a story, you know, handle their shit is they catch their heads, right? Oh, easily, bro. And it could be easily resolved, you know. If it's a problem, you know, if it was a mistake or, if, you know, if you really mean something, you know. And, mm-hmm. and like I said, it's cool when people, you know, you'll meet the real real artists. And and when you're meeting up, it's beyond artists. You know, you got heart, you know, that's love. Mm-hmm. You know, respect. You meet up. Hand to your business, you know. May the best man win and, you know, take chalk it up and move on you know right right but a lot of people you know like i said you know in the alley won't do that won't do that they kind of do like the sneaky shit and all the other shit yeah. well shit well we you, you have a story where like you guys kind of had like an issue with another crew but i mean it basically kind of got resolved in the end like the way it should be resolved oh yeah so, like you said, you, guys you, grown man. Should you mind talking about that or yeah, I don't mind that, bro. It was, uh, kind of what happened, and get up on the mic a little bit for me. Um, shit, uh, it was, you know, graffiti. Graffiti, graffiti shit, happens, you know? right? We're, we're, you know, we're we're stepping in, you know, trying we're to take over, you know. And, and yep, yep. if we see a wall dist for a while, you know, we're like, damn. Obviously, these artists don't care, or they're not fixing it, or taking care of it. So, what's kind of the period you give a motherfucker? You give them like a couple of weeks, or you give them like a month? Give you I mean, we're, day we're out there. <laughs> we're out there. So I'm like, yo, yeah, if something catches my eye, uh-huh. we have permission to do that wall. Take okay. it. Yeah, it, hey, most so, of the time, yeah. shit. Me, I don't have permission at all. I'm just, I'll fake it, you know. Yeah. And it works. You know, Ninety nine. <laughs> you know, yeah, but if I see something this for a while, I'm like, damn. Obviously, they don't care or whatever, so I'll pull up and I'll make a whole day of it. Production. You know, buff the wall. Yeah. You know, broad day. and It's it's Colorado now, bro. It, art, art is everywhere. And mainly these spots are in the Rhino or downtown or, you know, they shit down there shit. where people are like, oh, they're just doing art. Right. So it's easy. You know, I'll take it over and... If somebody got a problem with it, hits me up in a couple of days, I'm like, I'll keep it real. I'm like, yo, bro, like, you weren't doing shit. Like, that shit's been this. And and right now, like, we're, I'm, we're taking over. Like, not only, like, on the Vandal shit, like I told you, that's where I started off. So if right. I could catch a free wall and let my shit be seen and rock, like, really oh, yeah. Seen, yeah. Yeah, I'm like, I'm going to take advantage yeah, of it. So, straight. of course, I'm going to do it. And then if you want to come in, you know, Try to take it back. I'm mm-hmm. like, so basically, you hit up a wall that was this for like however long it was. You know what I mean? Yeah. And then somebody, another crew, hits you up and asks why you, you know, painted it or whatnot, right? Yep, of course. And then, uh, actually, we ran into them. They were just buffing on our shit, and you know, I oh, seen, they were buffing yeah. out the shit you had done. Yep. And okay. I was just like, yeah, we ran up on them, and I was like, get the fuck out of here, basically. And they did. They stopped. They left, and a week later, you know, he must have went and got with his boys. 
and kind of uh, let them know what was going down. Yep, and uh, you know, word around the block, they know how we roll. So he was just like, "How do you want to do it?" And I was like, "Like I said, it, we took it over. Basically, you didn't, you didn't, you didn't hold it down. Wall. Yeah, you didn't hold it down. And uh, we're we're uh, new and upcoming, and we're just you know, gonna, yeah. no disrespect, you know, like it's just yeah, y'all are y'all killers. Y'all y'all get it in. Very very talented, but you know, we ain't gonna let y'all have it. It's ours now. So they're like, well, all right, well, let's fight for it." You know, we're like, hell yeah. And we're like, well, no guns, no nothing. And we're like, we even, I was like, who? Where y'all want to meet? Gave it, gave, left it in, in their court, you know? Right. And, uh, yeah, like I said, we pulled up and there was like four of us, you know? <laughs> and, 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 the fe- and a female, you know? Mm-hmm. And there, there was, you know, about like 15 deep. And it was cool. We weren't even on that. We, the army caught the heads with uh, their boy, and and that was it. Squash beef, and they shook their hands like men. And, and after shook, that, it was basically done. Yeah, right? they were like, yeah, y'all could, y'all could have the wall. Y'all showed up. We, it was, it you know, kind of like men. So it was cool. Shout out to them. Yep. And the lesson there is like maintain your shit if it gets dissed. And I know it's hard sometimes, mm-hmm. but fuck. You know what I mean. <laughs> If you got a big ass shit, a wall, and that shit's dissed. Oh, yeah, because, it, you know, and if it's get riding for a while, you know, I'm just like, we're not the type of people like, oh, we're about to uh, just start costing everybody, taking over some shit, but I'm like, this shit's been dissed for a while. Obviously, this, they don't give a fuck, or, you know, it's 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 up for grabs, you know. And another thing, like, people, you know, from, from out of state, you mm-hmm. know. We'll see that shit. You know. And a lot of crews, they come in and they they paint and it gets dissed and I, I see it and I and I know they're from out of state because I've actually had a crews. I'm like, damn, we go to Denver and you RGK we went over us and I'm like, yo, bro, like, I got I one thing I'll, I'll take a picture and I'm like, yo, I'll I'll send it to you, you know, yeah. because we ain't on no bullshit. Yeah, people do get you know salty, you know. At the end of the day, I do. I'm like, damn, did you go over me? And there's been times I'm like, this food went over me. I'll hit up on me like, and then boom. He'd be like, nope, somebody was, you were dissed. And I'm like, all right, cool. Count, I'll chalk it up to the game. Sure. Like, right. Like, sometimes that's how it goes, like you, that. know? you know? Like, know what like what fuck, mean? that was yeah. a cool spot. But I'm like, you know, it's, you know I, I follow all the bottom rules. Chalk, you know? yeah, chalk it up to the game. What is it? Charge it to the game, I mean. No, that's one thing too, bro. Is like a lot of the young cats don't even know the rules, and at least you guys know fucking the rules. Like, yeah, you know what sure. I mean? And like, it ain't rocket science, shit. Yeah, not at all. Motherfuckers, oh, yeah. y'all got YouTube. C- coming into the game, <laughs> you got you know, YouTube. Coming right, into the yeah. game, how we were, we're just like, all right, graffiti. this is this is graffiti. We're about to we're about to paint. Like, this is this is how it goes, you know. So we're always like, yep, let's follow the rules, and we've always we've always done it, you know. We ain't on no hate and shit, like, trying to just cap who's, like... I I that's, like you said, that's the misconception, bro, is they kind of, you know what I mean, got got you heavy labeled as tag bangers, you know, still doing tag the same bangers. shit. You know what I mean? When, like, you guys ain't in that lane at all. I mean, the way I see you guys is as long as I don't disrespect you, you ain't gonna fuck with me. Yeah, that's basically you know what I mean? how it like, should be. Yes. You know, like, well, I'm trying to say, I'm trying to fucking, I'm all <laughs> high and shit, I'm trying to think of the words, but um, you know what I mean? Like, I I'm not gonna start no shit, but I'm gonna fucking handle shit if it comes my way all day. I'm not going yeah. out at the club or at the yard trying to fucking yeah, fuck with food and do my shit. If you're coming at us, we're gonna come, come at you. That's exactly. just how it is. Grown ass man I think we'll always be labeled as that, but I'm like, like I said, I was like, these are my brothers. We're a brotherhood, and uh, I don't see it like that at all. You know, right. like we just always protect each other and it's just, and hold down the crew. Hold down the you, you know, guys kind of like, hold down the crew like like more because sometimes crews are just a bunch of random people too. Yeah, that's true. And like you said, I ain't really trying to be in no crew. If we're painting, the motherfuckers roll up on us, and you run or fucking whatever. Like we need to, you know, oh, yeah, for sure. two there's or twenty of us. You know, we gotta handle this shit. Yeah, we go down together. Yeah. Right? There's, there's two some, of us, the squares, and there's four of them. Okay. You know what I mean? We're, the we all going down the together, square, bro. You gotta fucking at least yeah. fucking you know show. show some there's been art, some. Bro. There's yeah, been some dope is. writers, you know, and I'm like, you know, and I'd even they'd be like, yo, I want y'all are up. I want to get down, and I'd be like, "Yo, like it's it's a little rough, you know." I'm like, right. 
It's not what you think. Yeah, really. and I and I know my bros. I'm and I could read people. I'm like, yeah, this dude can handle it. I'm like, yeah, bet. But like other people, I'm like, yo, I, I want to get down. Like, I've known this like, cast since I was like, 13. and I'll and I'll tell them like, yo, like but people are probably might house. just run up on you and they're paying like you. It's gonna be a. You never know. It can I'm go like, down. That's all yeah, they need to know. Like, like, doing graffiti at any time, it can go down, whether if it's motherfuckers, the police, or the owner, or anything. It could just go down. Yeah, for sure, bro. Like, I'm like, all right, let's let this dope-ass artist, you know, you know, represent for us and this and that. And then, like, two weeks later, he's hitting me up. Hey, bro, I'm just, I'm going to just fall back. And, mm. you know, I had, I, I, had, I had these dudes pressing me and... Uh, or, yeah, threat, right. Threatening me This and that And I'm like Bro like That's the first sign though But that's kind of good I mean, But it's good it's kinda, yeah. it's, And that's yeah, why Yeah like, you in But at the same time It lets me know right away Like you ain't made of that You know Yep And that's why like We always like We, yeah, we get people uh, A that probation deep. A yeah. probation period Like you ain't You ain't gonna just Come and Can't sit in the on, circle You know what I mean You know You gotta put some but, uh, you, Like I said Like like lately bro It's 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 closed You know Like we're just We're we, we're it's us right now. And that's it You know what I mean Like Because that's Nobody can you prove know. Nobody has Shown us what they can use. And it's yeah. a, it's a new generation you know? No a lot of people Have got our eyes for sure It's yeah. definitely a, a lot of people small circle sure. You know what I mean And like We all build from the same plot You know what I mean exactly. It's hard to find It's hard to find people like that You know what I mean Cause what is it, uh, Definitely now sharp, sharp Nowadays iron, bro, that's, like, that's I just see some of these crews And they're just like Oh this is the homie But you only see them like what every uh, once a week or twice a week, like mm-hmm. you know, like we're actually a brotherhood, you know, like they they're at my my family functions and Fuck yeah. uh, you know like da- daily, daily shit, you yeah, know what I mean? Interact on the daily. And and I'm not saying other crews are like that, like hell yeah, I every I'm pretty sure crews are hella close, but like yeah. there's crews that are are not. You, know? and you said yeah, we asshole type. <laughs> definitely <laughs> is, but you know we all hold it down, like. We, you know what I mean? It's all yeah. love. Like I Just said, we get mad at each you know. other, but we, at the end of the day, it works out. Yeah, it's all love. It like, makes oh, us yeah. stronger. Oh, yeah. We, it we, we be painting and, love, you know what I mean? There's, there's nights we be painting and I'm like, I'll get this letter, I'll get this letter, and I'm like, I don't fucking like your G, and like, well, you do a R, you do a G, you do a K, and you know, we be sitting there and I'm like, these are my brothers, I'm like, mm. fuck. But we all push each other, you know, like, on a whole nother level. And you guys have some, like, favorite spots that you guys have caught? Yeah, uh, most have. <laughs> shit, the one that's on the highway, the I-25, that Ruthless Graffiti Kings. I know that's, everybody that's sees that one. one. That's one big one. Like Eighth in Santa Fe. Eighth in the I-25 eighth in right there. When you, you drive up Eighth into I-25 or even up Eighth, that little Eighth Road right there, uh-huh. that little Eighth Bridge. The Ruthless Graffiti Kings. You see that big-ass red, white, band Ruthless Graffiti Kings. Oh, I'm high, bro. I don't turn your fucking tongue around all day. Yeah, I know. The yeah. big-ass roller, bro. Yeah. Roller, bro. Hey, like, you want to talk hour. about a mission? How long did that take y'all, man? Like four days. Well, it took, four it only took that long because we, we ran out of pain. But in reality, if you put it all together, like six hours. Six to seven. Um, Six to seven hours. Eight. We was up to so the job like how long did we out of pain or what? We, we was, was out, out there, there till the morning. morning. Yeah, the we birds were shit. coming like, up. I mean, remember that? Like, it was, it, hey, and at the time, happened, but that's, it was a whole beef. So like, yeah. oh yeah, yeah. You're watching out yeah, for that too. Yeah, we watching too. to see if we uh, see niggas walking through the shadows. We even, we even well, almost well, like. We was even up there. We had a car driving up eighth, and they tried to stop and whistle and holler. At so us, we did the whole, we did the whole roof. The next night, they got dissed. They had a party. So though. you know we're we're barely missing each other. Right. And uh, that's but, really how it works. Right? Yeah. With but they ended up cutting the ladder, no. No, cut yeah, we now. we cut the ladder. We because it, it started getting dissed. We was like, bro, fuck that. Like, we ain't about yeah. to have our shit. Sometimes. Dissed. And it and was it, it was late. Nice. Yeah. You know what y'all I mean? use? What y'all use to cut it? Shit, I can't. I don't know. Like, it, yeah. I wasn't Milwaukee part of saw. It. Milwaukee saw. It, it was a mil. Was it Milwaukee saw? It was a little yeah, yeah. Milwaukee. Mil- mil- it had to have been a little Milwaukee. Hey, I'm, I wasn't up Milwaukee there. Like I said, I'm a, I'm there. afraid of heights. I'm on the ground. I if you see something by Herc Dog, put, you know it's on the ground. I put grease all yeah, over the roof. Grease, glass. I think they put like glass all. Yeah. Razor, that's what I was say, razor blades. Sometimes when you do shit like that, like that's a big ass fucking shit. We had to. On the other side is that rebel. And they had security there, bro. So we're rope. We had a rope and we were 
roping. Roping up the paint. Five gallon buckets with rollers yeah. and, and the security like guard was over there. We do missions passing the Yeah, yeah it was bro. it was it rough. Like that, we we're on the roof like I remember me and Reed were getting in there like He's like, don't fucking feel that in. I'm like, bro, I, I got this back up. And it was, yeah. I was like, we were running I'm out ready of to go home. It was, like, it was crazy. I was like, it was a mission with, a bunch of like with all the boys. Kids, it was good. Kids rolled up too. Like we heard. Yeah, we, we boys, so we they were having. A, they had like a little rave downstairs. It was crazy. It was all dark. Uh, Raving uh, in the uh, bando. Oh, okay. It was so And they came up to the roof trying to see the yeah, view. We uh, and we're painting, getting it in, and, oh, and, and, it, and it's been war. So I'm like, yeah. you rocked uh, up on the wrong hard. niggas. Yeah, you guys are on the wrong roof right now. What's up? So they rolled up on you. Yeah, I was like, I got rolled up on you, but they like came up. Hey, they're all yeah. Hey, they're. So like, girl, what you do? Check this out. Yeah, this girl. And they like, click, click. And then, bam, yeah, like, yeah. like, 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 Caught them fools by uh, surprise with their hands up. Yeah, like, 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 get the fuck out of here. Hey. Well, they um, scared was, me like, too. The I was like, they're rolling up deep. Two people walking out. Oh, uh, yeah. And it, because it, it, it they had like, I don't know how long it was, like a three day rave or some shit, but it got yeah, nervous. Yeah. They thought it was like, because there was people like three scattering around them. It was dark as fuck uh-huh. when they left. Seven. They was like back to back. They had poles and shit, like big ass poles. Hey, they they're cooked. The they they knew that they were like, oh. You shit. said a three day rave? Bro, hey, in there. a bando, bro, they was getting it. They was fucking. Yeah. We were going back. That's what I said. Warehouse. I was we're like, we're going like, back at the end of the night. They were still there. Party looking at us. Party. Full of graffiti, broken bricks, like, no light. You're fucking, we over here shining the beam on the guns to get light and shit. Uh, yeah. We over here walking through the dark. <laughs> yeah. Here, yeah you can tell they were scared. There was some, like, some like little white, like white. They was I don't know white. How they got up there. I was like, I don't know what the they, fuck? Are they they yeah, just, it, the, it was like, it. dude, it was all dark, and all you hear is footsteps. Trying to see yeah. the view. Yeah. We didn't know who the fuck it was. We had everything like, we could. Not can, tonight, dude. bro. It was like most spots, like moving. we're we're basically maintaining, bro, huh? Like, yeah, yeah, like yeah, constant maintain of these like genuine ass iconic spots, man. Like it's so hard, you know. We. Maintain like spot. Man hours for sure. Back up, up there and fixing that shit. Yeah. Okay. Hey, like, I, like I told you, cut Joe, the fucking ladder cut off. Ladder <laughs> off. Caught, Make sure ain't nobody these, going up that these bitch, bro. Right? In the act. <clears throat> ain't nobody going Dissing up there no us. more. I promise. I was like, oh yeah, that's that. Because there was you, two ladders. I think we cut both of them. Two. Hold up, real quick. You were saying you you've were you, you've caught people dissing your shit. Yeah, or bro. Uh, me me and the bro. No, they were dissing us. So this is a whole different story, right? Yeah, a whole I got different you, I got story. You. Go for it, go for it. it. It was back That's and forth. It was back and back and Were forth for that man? spot. So Most we're like, dead. damn, mm-hmm. let's. Uh, it was already like end of the night, and uh, we started at that spot. It was crazy. It's like the first spot you went to. The yeah. last spot you kind of went to go to go see it, and then caught. It was clothes. the first oh. first spot we uh, fixed. Uh huh. And uh, service it. They went in. At the end of the night, we're like, let's drive by. Boom, because they were active too. They were so out they there. Were down it, it, were peeping. Yeah, it was like back and forth, and I was like, "Fuck, it's a it's a war right now." And uh, sure shit, bam, seen him getting it, and I was like, "Let's." Hey, we we jumped out and Tommy's had the bats, the, the chains, and hey, we, we rolled up and we caught him slipping. Hey, a couple, we only caught two of them. They're like five deep. Mm-hmm. And thought- on some bitch shit, all their homies ran. They were all trying to run, but we caught we caught two of them and we beat the fuck out. They kind of caught the ride. Yeah, yeah, we did the thing and took the paint and fixed the piece and it was, you know, it was like hell yeah, don't victory. The, if you're gonna diss some shit, don't be the one that gets caught. Bro, you yeah. can't. Yeah. You can't. I'm gonna tell you, hey, you have some bear mace on you. You got all those motherfuckers. Yeah. No, man. Yeah. Hey, hey, that bear beater, mace is bro. deadly, bro. Me, bro. I took my house with the bear mace. <laughs> I, I, I ran up on, I ran up on the wrong nigga, <laughs> and he, hey, lit, hey, dog, lit me will, up with will, the bear mace. I will tell you one thing, bro. If you're rolling solo dolo, and you're going in the hostile environments where you think. 10, 20 deep and it might go down. You have that shit. You will make it out oh, alive. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 So yeah. spray it yeah. the other way, but oh, like, yeah. it will definitely handle a gang of motherfuckers. Deadly. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That shit is... I mean, it takes down a fucking yeah. bear. You know I mean? It's gonna take down a group at least, bro. I ran up on, I ran up on the up yeah. all happy and bam. I was like, what the fuck that was that? That one for I can't. 
uh, that Charleston Whiteful did that shit to Soldier Boy. Yeah. Mm. They ran up on him and that was for spraying him with bear. I don't know if bear <laughs> made a place and they dissipated nice. everything. That's fucked up. And that's been around for a while. Like, and, and a lot of people are like, I don't know, like, if they're put on to that shit. But, no, the, know, homie, like, the homie Preach kind of brought that out here, fool, from San he? Diego. That's like a Cali theme. Because I seen a Kyer yep, spraying that shit a lot. Hey, and no lie. Young as fuck, like uh, I grew up uh, next to Hack and uh, Hulk and Kai and them, and mm-hmm. we we had some fucking beef. And young as fuck, first time I ever experienced Bear was with 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 them. I was like, they hit me up, and I was like, what the fuck was that? <laughs> that shit that yeah. feel like a fucking rock that just gets in your holy pores, bro. Shit. Like, bro. You, can't, you can't sleep, like it's in there. Yeah, I was like, damn, I need to. It's like almost a skunk. And then, bag. yeah, and I was like, and then it just started, everybody started carrying it. Because, no lie, I got hit with that shit like twice. Yeah, one tip about I was like, oh, bases, no. You want to keep that safety clip in there for sure. Oh, yeah, for sure. I remember I tossed my shit in the back, and then I had to take my kids to school the next day. Oh, shit. And they got in the car, and they're all crying. I was like, what the fuck's going on? And yeah, my shit was. It, it emptied in the fucking car. Kids bear mace themselves. I, I, I all bear oh, mace yeah. my kids in the fucking car. Yeah, so, hey, brother, saints, no fucking safety on it. Hit us in the car. Oh man. Yeah, so that's one tip I could say from, from Big Shit. Hurt Dog is keep that safety clip Remember on that, that fucking that bear mace. Extinguishers. If you ever fuck with the extinguishers, I, I know the homie that fucking had that shit go off in this car twice. Shh. Hey. hey, my Get my bro my hit my whole. Brand new 2019 <laughs> fucking Jeep. Oh, man. And he jumped in the car. Oh, yeah, I hit it right when he put it down his fucking head. That trigger Across on that extinguisher. The whole, that was so everything. And the bad delicate. part, my girl was driving. It was, it was, she was She like, was tripping. She's about we're to pull out the shit. Hey, I got to go. The whole hey, night was canceled. Amazed, we had to go. Like, Clean. I was like, oh fuck. Shit, my girl being pissed Good one time. Times. What's that thing where you heat your can and put one in the freezer and you transfer the paint from the yeah. rest? Of, yeah. So I was fucking up. I was hitting it all day doing that, making my can fill up, can fill up, and I didn't fill up the water on the last fucking one, right? Sure enough, I'm chilling with my girl in the fucking front room, and I kid you not, all I hear is a boom. And the fucking rusto explodes in the fucking kitchen and shoots the can up to the fucking roof, bro. And you're black everywhere, fucking Ooh. rusto fat black everywhere, bro. I had to fucking scrub that shit off. My lady was pissed, yo. She was pissed. I'm just over like, there yeah, trying to make the everything black. Yeah, that's the <laughs> worst. You know? hey, I can't have nothing nice. I, yeah. I, I'll get a new fit and fucking, it's I want to go get a fresh, dog. nice Montana to match the fit and bam, it's gay. Everything's destroyed. I'm like, yep. I'm like, I'll get a fresh model. I'll just get a new song, yeah. Well, this was a racking god, I mean. Every time you try that shit, man, you know what I mean? Try to avoid it, it happens. Yeah, oh, it's, it's gonna work. You'll find uh, a small you like, said, new J- crazy. like you said, you might catch a tag with a fucking mop and fucking too yeah. much. Yeah. Oh, oh I'm, the, I'm the worst with it, bro. I'll be like, hell yeah. Just recently, brand new J's and boom, boom. I look down and I'm like, oh, I'm gonna hit a couple blocks, I'll jump out and jump back in. I'm like, I'm a fucking Dude, mess. Like, I'm a fucking mess, yeah. On the brand new shoes and shit, I'm like, fuck. Oh. I don't even know the beaters, yeah. I don't. Take I don't, don't drink and paint no more, none of that shit. I try to. Just, just, fuck just for that too. reason, bro, because I'd okay. like to be, like, understanding of what the fuck's going on. The, the most I'll do is, like, maybe a bump. Maybe I'll smoke a blunt. Mm-hmm. Who knows? He said maybe. Bump, 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 bump. Get you going. I mean, if, if, yeah, if I'm tired. Bro, bro, hey. bro, but uh, yeah, for sure. Like, but other than that, I, I try to remain more vigilant. You know what I mean? Cause so I can fuck shit up and it looks nice, and I don't fuck shit up and it looks like shit. You know what right. I mean? Cause that's re- that reps on me. You know, people will be like, "Damn, oh, yeah, you killed it all fucking night, but it looks like garbage, bro." Like that's the shit I don't get. If you're gonna go out and kill all fucking night and get up and waste all them cans, especially if you're paying for your fucking paint, <laughs> like get. Get it in. Make that shit look nice, bro. Don't get all faded or... No, for oh, sure. Hey, make that shit. Shout out to hey, my boy, my Herd, boy kills it. because my boy he's kills been it. getting up lately. Like, I'm like, damn, I see you, fam. Like, oh, hell yeah. And bashful. I want to ask you, what's worse, getting paint on your shoes or your jacket? Your shoes, bro. I'm 
I'm like, fuck. It, it depends on the shoes, though. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, it depends I'll on the like jacket. Jay, like, just oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. And like, if you if can't get them out and you just fucked them off, I'm like, yeah. Because there's been a lot of sweaters. I'm more of a sweater, dude. I'm like, I have some sick well, sweaters. A killer. And I'm like, fuck, they're, they're done for, for sure. You, uh, know? Yeah. you ain't got no crank mm-hmm. black or out. That's really like, the wife's like, this ain't coming out. <laughs> I kind of always learned real quick, though, just putting that shit in the plastic, like a Ziploc bag, bro, because that shit will explode just out of nowhere. Yeah. yeah. Fuck everything up. Yeah, everything's yeah. all fucked on the inside of your pocket, then you got a big ass spot you right here. Your hand is like, oh, like, like some, what is and, that for? And I like tagging, walking, you know what I mean? So yeah. I'm just like yeah, putting it constantly. back in. Yeah. Time bomber. For sure, yeah. I look down, I'm like, damn, like, it's definitely but on. It's everywhere. Like, it's everywhere. It's going to happen. All right. All right, man. Well, shit, one of the things we kind of always ask, man, is kind of crazy stories, man, kind of crazy situations. And y'all being like, you know what I mean? Like, I don't want to say gangsters, but being, you know, being, you know, where y'all, what y'all do, man, y'all definitely on a different level, you know what I mean? Compared to like normal graffiti crews. Oh, yeah, for sure. Normal graffiti crew got to deal with some beef about graffiti. You guys back in the day are kind of dealing with gangs, like, you know what I mean? Like fucking graffiti and then just fucking just calling the ruckus you know what I mean but what kind of crazy shit you know have y'all already had any runs with the police like crazy fox just, you know whatever y'all wanna fucking tell man I'm gonna start off with fucking Herc Big Herc shit just recently bro I was on I-70 I was hitting the RGK by myself uh, that's when they were doing the construction on the new highway right by the V arena right yeah with the uh, it's Q-Wit construction shout out Q-Wit construction um so I was hitting right under there, bro. I was the first one, did a big ass RGK. It was black, white, a little bit of pink, and I was hitting that background. And sure enough, the fucking supervisor from the construction seen the median, that fool some way found a gap and just started coming towards me Jumped onto that shit on fucking onward traffic, bro. On- um, and my ass, I haven't ran in a minute, but sure enough, nigga, I hit the bricks on that motherfucker. I was gone. He did not catch me. I hit my baby mama up later, and I was like, come pick me up right over here around the corner, shit. Yeah, that's that's all I got just recently because I keep it. What about some back in the day, man? Kind of when you first start growing, doing graffiti that made you like, fuck, this is this shit is real. Shit, man, back in the day. Because <laughs> back in the, I mean, do you think it's wilder back in the day or wilder now, or is it well, just the same? Just back in the day, I was hitting like I was murdering federal. I was crossing every crew by myself. I was a young little cat. I never really, I, I, I remained by myself, you know, even Reject knows, you know, I was just chill by myself. He was the only one that I really kept close to me growing up to, in the crew. Um, but uh, not just murdering shit, bro, when I was young, just straight murdering shit, keeping shit low. I knew, I, I learned on my own. Like, I learned right. the rules. I figured out a way. Like, I was a ninja. I was a ninja nigga. He's a big ninja. Big, <laughs> big ninja big. nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Big work, dog. Yeah, you see me out here with this mask. Best believe I'm, I'm putting in work. Uh, hell yeah. What about you, reject? Yeah, brother. <clears throat> I could go on for days, bro. Like <laughs> the whole podcast. No, just yeah. I, I'd go Sometimes out it goes solo down, bro, nights. Like, I, uh, I have missions where days. I'd be solo and sometimes do you like bombing solo or with, with your homies or both or don't no, matter. You know what I mean? Uh, both. But some days, you know, I have my days and I'm like, I, I'm. I'm on a whole mission. I'll go catch some ups just by myself, you know. But uh, on some uh, on some wild shit, you know, I've had people, you know, run up and you know, he's had, you got to get down sometimes, you know. And then I've had the uh, wild police chases, you know. Recently, with me and Breed running through the Rhino, bro, and uh, you know, through the Rhino, you think it's you would, chill. Yeah, you would think it'd be yeah, normal. Yeah, and uh, we're hitting something, and I'm like, who? Bam! He lights us up. We run away. Fucking next alley, he's right there on us. We're hitting a couple of fences. He's right there on us. Hey, it was it was wild and got away, but he was hitting a backup. And I'm like, damn, you wouldn't think of it like that. But I've had nights like that, man, where you kind of feel like the same. It's like a video game, and the same cop is kind of like tailing you and like oh, yeah. you're seeing. Oh, he him, wasn't like, I'm up. going this way, he's going that way, so now mm-hmm. I got to double back and then. Back. Yeah. I mean, and you he, go this way and you think you're gone, then he pops out of nowhere, and then you know what I mean? Just, just nonstop, bro. Yeah. But, uh, you know, even even young growing up, you know, where, where RG was originated, you know, it was a lot of, uh, we were in a rough neighborhood, you know, so, you know, Denver, Denver is well, Colorado's always been about that. Right. You know? So I've even, I've no even had shit, essays you know I mean? even, from you know, Colorado, you know, running up, what's good, and shit gets wild, you know, it's just, it's the risk you take going out bombing. Right. Have you ever had any deal with any kind of like, um, 
how would I say them, like Good Samaritans or like when you're racking, like fools trying to stop you from getting your pain or anything oh, like yeah, that? Oh, yeah, bro. Shit, we've had, mainly when I was younger, you know, people trying to be a fucking hero and a couple, couple of while, hey, back in the day, I used to hit Walmart, you know, before even Home Depot, so that was just risky shit and ran into a couple of heroes there and a couple of Karens, but you know, you're going to run into that anyway, racking paint. Right, it's just kind of changed, you know what I mean? Ever since like, um, yeah. now they got that new security little gate on yeah. Home Depot, yeah. you know, going mm-hmm. off. So that technology well, uh, is fucking making it. Is the technology making it harder, or do you think it's still the same? It is what it is. You just got to do know what you're doing. I just feel like they're up the game. You know, they mm-hmm. they know what's up. They're they're losing money, fucking getting racked here. You know, whatever. It's a business, so mm-hmm. I'm pretty sure they're gonna get onto the. I, the game, pretty sure. I even heard like some shit, bro, where they're like, um, like with their high end tools, like they're gonna have like almost like a code that you need, like if. You oh yeah, can. they're already putting fucking little security locks on and everything, you know. So if you walk out, you're ringed up. Oh, yeah. What's going on? So. Have you ever had any, any crazy encounters with the cops? Yeah, bro, I've gotten caught uh, 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 quite a few, you know, growing up, you know, being being the young buck, I've. That's one thing. I, I got caught like probably like four times, and you live and learn. You know, hate, had hating hot spots and beat hate. the fuck out of you or no? Uh, no, one time I was getting smart with a fucking Asian cop, and he was like, "I'm gonna kick you in the fucking teeth." And I was like, "All right, that." Sorry, man. My eyes all shut up. You know, I was yeah, like no, trying to talk real. my way out of it. But, wasn't happening. Nah, you, we all have that friend, bro, that kind of like fucking like you're just like, man, please don't fucking. Yeah. And they start talking and when talking. You, when and you talking. know they got you, they got you, so it's just like, fuck, you know. <laughs> you know they got you. Yeah, they got big, you. big yeah. cop bombing. Yeah, know sure. the game and don't get caught. Hell yeah. Hey, what about you there, Doer? I know you've been fucking, you fucking done a bunch of bombing, man. What kind of crazy shit you've seen, you've witnessed? Man, I kind of, uh, I'm with the uh, reject here. Honestly, I've kind of done been through it all. When it comes to racking, having to do with like shit, I ain't gonna name names, but I was with one of the homies, and we were racking. Like we was on a steady mission. We hit like th- full Home Depot. It was like three See, Home Depots before. You can't do that, dog. You gotta that, hit I know. We was, on, we was on a mission. <laughs> I know. <laughs> we was hitting though, but uh, it, it is what it is. What we we fucked up on is we was hitting. We're normally here, we have a little routine. Right. We went out of our routine. We we were just up. We was we was on another little mission, real quick, just to make a run. Uh-huh. And then it just, you know, we seen the Home Depot. We stopped. It happened. This little short, it was like spur of the moment. Little short shit. chick walked up. She, we was hitting. We had the buckets. We filled them up. We was out that bitch. She was on us. She was like, "You gonna really do that?" Do, 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 do. It is what it is, though. It happened. What happened happened. You know, we got we got. Does it take long to put that much paint in one of those buckets, or like how do you? Because nah, those people is. are kind of right there, aren't they? Should take like a forty five seconds. Hmm. It shouldn't take too long. Much. Or, it's gotta go. Just gotta go. Just gotta go. Just gotta go. How much in a bucket? It's go time. Shit, you can fit like twenty. No, you can oh, fit fifty in two buckets. So it's twenty. No, you can fit twenty six if you fit it right. You can fit 26, you're walking out with 52 cans. God and everything damn. I love. And two buckets. Two of the little yellows. Or the little oranges, my bad. But either way, you know, like I said, I, I've done been through it all. Like, I've, me and my boy Breed, and Sage, we were on a little mission too. We was just paying this dude. I don't know what happened. He was on a bike. He did some dumb shit. I was like, what's up then? He ran up on the boots. He was big too. I mean, I'm tall, you know what so I mean? So he ran up and he, he popped him real quick? Oh, he just happened. That's what you gotta bah, 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 do, bro. <laughs> it just went down. He, it, it, he didn't drop though, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. He was eating it. We was hitting him. Bah, 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 bah. He was eating him. He must have been faded or something. My boy Sage <laughs> got him down. It just happened. Boom, boom, boom. So, you know what I mean? Who is it? He just ate him. <laughs> he was eating him. I don't know what else to say. He was just, he was he eating was him. Ash, ash, ash. But, you know, he just, he ran up on I don't even know what the issue was. Really, I don't remember because it, it was that little. You know what I mean? Right. But it just happened that quick. Yeah. I, he tried to run me over with his bike. He, you know, Damn. it was one of those nights. You ever deal with any crazy homeless motherfuckers? Nah, cause actually I just you know like I give them the respect, but then when they I've had I had had a trip on one because we me and my boy we was paying and he was trying to walk up he was like 
hey, this is my block, whoop de whoop. I was trying to flex, yeah. Yeah, and then we was letting him talk for a little bit after a while. I was, I was like, homie, this is our block. It's, it's our cool. hood. What you mean? This is our city. Right. Uh, our big RGK. I was like, all right, if I hop over this fence, I'm going to beat your ass. Hopped over the fence. He ran. He ran <laughs> he back to his tent. Over, man. He was like, I didn't want no issues. Put, I was just, put up a I do not disturb sign. I was like, homie, like, who is you tripping on? Right, yeah. You know what I mean? It, it, just, it just happened. You know what I mean? I, it is what it is. Uh, but yeah. you know what I mean? And Should be little, getting crazy, you know what I mean? Yeah, exactly. Sometimes the shit happens. Should be getting crazy. What about you there, Tragic? The shit. youngest RG said some of the crazy shit I tell you happened was with these niggas. All the bit was with these niggas. I've only had like a few by myself with my other homies, but it's always been with these foods like but most of them always left on some bad on some bad shit, like anytime it's beef or I need some crazy shit, mm -hmm. it's gonna leave on some bad shit, so that's pretty much mostly what I've been with these foods. No, you gotta kinda like you said, kinda try to get taken care of me, you know what I mean? Yeah. And hey, then, what? Uh, Fucking me and my homie was on one of the mission and you know it's a lot of shit with the pigs too that food like ended up getting bumped up and shit like that but really just simple shit like that. That's normal shit to us though like that's you know, that normal take yeah. that is. Yeah, it's just normal. Right what on. about that what about that fall you took on the bottom? Oh yeah, yeah. over here jumping oh. fences with these foods. It's, 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 it's the young these, bro, bro. We're over here trying to jump these fences and shit and they have the it's the fence with the, like, you know, like, you the can spice. get your foot stuck in that yeah. bitch. You can get your foot stuck in. Go over here, nigga, hop the fence, hop the fence. And you're like, fool, shut the fuck up. Like, I know how to jump a fence. <laughs> I, know. Know. I was like, I know how to jump a fucking fence. So I was like, watch out. And I just... My foot got stuck oh, on that bitch. Boom. I remember first, that. Like, face first like from like 10, feet. Yeah, like 12, 12 feet. Yeah. It was, was just, like, it just oh. happened. He lost his shoe. Bounce off. I had to go oh, get his shoe. I was like, nigga, brother. I remember. I got yeah. lucky on barely... Missing a rock right there. Fuck yeah. Oh, like, oh, yeah shit like that. <laughs> that was a good one. That was a good one. You gotta hate that, that shit, was a bro. Good one, bro. Hey. All the homies were like, it was a, trash. It was a battle wound, though. Oh, God. For a little bit. Hey. It shit happens, you know what I mean? I was walking one time behind Perina when they had like the buildings there, like the the walls on 40th, man, and yeah. they were like holes. Yeah. We were doing a roller. And I uh, swear I fell in the uh, hole like three times that night. I was the only one there. We were like eight deep. And you could just pitch black. But you could see the blue. Hey, that's yeah. me, bro. That's me. And then blue. And I was like, motherfucker, that's better than blue. Like, God damn, I'm going home. Oh, Fuck yeah. this yeah. shit. And the craziest one, one of the homies on I-25, like 58, bro, uh, where it hit, climbing up a pole. The homie went up. I was like behind him. The other homie was going up. I'm right behind him. He falls. Damn. What? I'm like, look down, and he's he's out cold. I'm like, damn, the homie fell from like ten feet. I go back down, and I'm like, to wake him up. I'm like he's sleep. good, and I thought he was fucking around. I'm like, nah, the homie's out. <laughs> I'm like screaming at the homies on the roof. I'm like, hey, fam, uh, my nigga fell hard, bro. And he got up, like, what's good? Let's get it going. I'm like, nah, you good? Like, I'm good. Climbed up there like nothing. I was like, you fucking. He wild, bro. I'm like, shook that, it off and kept it going. That's crazy. Filled in the piece. <laughs> I was like, that, that's wild. Hey, what are some other, like, of your favorite spots that you guys got around town throughout the years, man? We were mainly, like, highway. We like getting big, big right. shit, highway spot. That's my shit. Know? Yeah, <laughs> that's where I like to get. A lot of the homies like to get inner city and, Everything. you know. I like it all, but I do like the highways, bro. Cause especially, like I tell you, Denver's like LA, just ten years behind. So fucking traffic's fucked. Oh yeah. So it's gonna be slow, and people are gonna see exactly. that shit on boxes exactly. or wherever. I feel like that's a that's a thing where we stood out. We we're we we're always trying to get that big shit going out of town, mm -hmm. getting this and that, you know. So highways. Yep. Have you ever guys been out of town painting? Uh, just to I went to LA. Uh, recently I was out in Phoenix catching some tags. It's fucking it's dope out there. But, uh, not really. Nah. It's a state hood. I hear that, man. Shit. You know what I mean? I definitely need to travel. Oh, yeah. Well, shit, man. Like, shit. What kind of... Where do you guys want to see yourself in, like, a year, man? Uh, basically, as a writer, I, I want to get on trains more. That's because what you're right now, saying. Like, trains and, and, and doing yeah, some art. Yeah, right now, my boy Joe, like, I'm, I'm, I'm getting older and I got a whole business and... 
you know, outside of life, you know, family, kids, mm-hmm. but I still, I'm an artist, I'm a painter, these are my bros, my girl lets me sneak away, I want to catch trains, you know, mm-hmm. because when I would get away, I'd be like, let's, let's hit the streets, and, you know, I've hit in every fucking street in Denver, you know, I was walking, walking like, two months ago on the streets in downtown, I was like, damn, I hit that roof, hit that roof, you know, I'm like... <laughs> I'm done with it, so I'm I'm 30. I feel like if I start catching trains, stepping my game up, taking a sketch to the fucking train, yeah, it'll be good for me. You know? What kind of art do you want to do? You want to you're like doing letters, like your name, or like some other just like uh, do you have any? You know what I mean, or just some different shit. I'm a letterhead for sure. I th- feel like more uh, artist wise is breed, mm-hmm. hurt, hijack, that come on with characters. Dewey's a fucking product, I mean, I prodigy in the bro, making. You know what I mean. He's gonna, he's a prodigy in the making, but he's coming off with like oh, yeah. his own shit style. And so I feel like we're all gonna be more evolving. We may not be in the streets as much, but we'll definitely, you know, the younger generation's gonna make sure we're up. I mean, we need to get you guys on some crew trips, bro. We need to get you. Yeah, you know I have another picture for you, but that's a little canvas I do. <laughs> Okay, yeah, that's just sight. That's me. You see that little character? That's me. I had a character for him. <laughs> Hell yeah. Really? That's dope, bro. Shit. I'm going to have to get some from I'm gonna you. I'm going to see if I can find you this D, though, that I've been Hey, because like, uh, lately, like, I've been going out with uh, uh, Clips. He comes to the barbershop. Yeah, okay. You know what I mean? So we, he comes to the barbershop. We get a little buzz on. We'll catch a little daylight. And I go back to work. Yeah, I'm like, Shout we out, buy it hard. You know, we'll go to Shout the fucking out Clips. Rhino Captain Shaw. <laughs> You know, him and EK are cool as fuck. Oh, but yeah. they be telling me the same shit. You need to travel, hit up the That's TKL the shit, bro, homies, for real. Like, That's yeah. the shit. I've only, like, I haven't traveled much, but I've definitely traveled to LA, like, I six lost. or seven times. I'm going back to the next month, shit. I'm so, are you guys uh, yeah. deep? Are you guys, uh, lo- you yeah, guys like, got numbers? Yeah, I mean, yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, what is it? The, the... Like, crew wide? You guys are fucking. The like, there's like, um, Fuck, there's like a there's like a good handful of cats. And I bro. follow like several of TKO hitters. Like, like you said like that dude works. Yeah, like you said oh, Durham's in, in LA. Like, uh, like Stack or what is it? Yeah. Stack or something? Or? Stack. He, yeah, TKO bro, like they're just like sick ass artists. Just put oh, homie Jackal's been going off yeah, in Jack- LA, bro. Hey, he like, actually Jack- was crazy, cool. Bro. I met him at a, a, a at the art show. Art yeah, show. He that fool pulled up on his own yeah. wild, like hey, man, uh, Heisen. <laughs> yeah, we were there uh, that night. He pulled uh, up all wild. Me, me and Heisen, we were, we yeah, kinda, yeah. even before that, that dude stood the night at my crib, and I didn't even really know. Nah, that's funny. He came through with the homies. Like, we partied all night. I was like, take the couch, brother. Yeah. Wow, he he's fucking cute, you know? got up, still up, went fucking quick with as fuck. Like, bro, man, when I went painting the house, I was like, I need to fucking step my game up. He's on that like, fucking level, like, bro. Like, he was going the with a, I was doing like a fucking like straight letter. He had a background, a 3D. He, before I even you know, I, I looked over, I'm like, I'm like, damn, bro, I didn't know it. I'm like, anywhere going like that. My boy's quick and he's he's an animal. Yeah, it's quick with those throwies, bro. Like, you know what I mean? Quick up. with everything. Shit, shout out. Yeah, he's he's definitely uh in the in the this generation of bomber, you know. Not for real, for real. And I feel like you know, shoes, the shoe, you know, he's he shows love and I feel just, just on another level, bro. Kill the game. Savage. What about you guys, man? Where you guys gonna want to kind of take you, where you what you've been doing in the next year? Like roller game, I'm moving Decent up. Roller. Yeah, I've done my straight letters. I've done my throwies. I've done my tag bombing, my stickers. I've hit the galleries. I'm gonna stay in that shit too. I'm trying to move some clothing line, uh, clothing shit pushing, you know. But definitely gonna push onto some rollers. I'm trying to go big, you know, go hard, and go home. It's time to grow the fuck up. Yeah, that's a good way to put shit. I, I think that's exactly what Reject was talking about. So I'll be with him on his train game. If... Do some whole cars. There you go. You take yeah. the roller and there then you take go. the train and just do some whole cars. Like you said, that's what my yeah. homie works be doing the fucking oh, yeah. big ass whole cars, dog. Yeah, like, yeah. A lot of riders. Shout out to me. You know? I know the homie it's fucking so Solar low, and Ignore do a couple podcasts that, that I'm fucking doing whole cars. You know what I mean? Shout out to Solar. Oh, yeah. So I remember one night full right there on six, we fucking ran in like a million motherfuckers on that shit. It was a big ass train line and 
we roll up and there's some fools painting right at the bridge and we go down more and him and ignore doing the whole cars and we go down there's some more motherfuckers we finally get down finally like damn like that's cool man that's crazy he said like, cause like, <laughs> like, a lot of writers they, they show so love cute. and that's what's up yeah, I, I appreciate it cause they be like yo reject like what's that, hit the, the train yard and I'm like building? even a couple of them like I, I know y'all he's like y'all missing out let me tell you he's like you ain't in the train yard and he's like come hit this I'm like you like say you gotta up. think about that shit for that can go like far yeah and especially now like like I said, I already killed the streets, Man. killed Colorado. Either I need to travel or hit the trains. Hell yeah. Both. I got a gang of kids. Definitely both. I got to travel with all my babies. Right? This is how. <laughs> is it expensive or what? Yeah, fuck yeah, it is. I, I get my vacation. You got a fucking basketball team over I get here? My right? Man, the train team, vacation. that's going to be the next runners up on the RGK. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Bunch of little Mexicans. Hell so yeah. yeah bro. Bro. I'm trying to do basketball, yeah, right? But little fucking Hispanic Honduran babies. I'm going to run. Squad goals. Hell yeah. What about you there, Dewar? Where you kind of want to see yourself, man, as far as graffiti wise and by the year? Honestly, I'm still growing, you know. I'm still uh, progressing. In a year, I want to be able to... Honestly, I don't really have a goal. Yeah, exactly. Mm-hmm. I just want to see myself progress. I want to see me get just better. I want to however... I wanna, I wanna see my can control get better. I want to see my lines get better. That's what I want to see out of me. Right. Other than that, I, you know, I'm still young. I got time. I, I got time to build, time to grow. I'm trying to... Um, I'm trying to start something for sure, but at the moment, I don't know what that is. You know what I mean? I'm still in trying that. to find it. Yeah, you know, like right now, I, I, just, I, I just really well, work. Well, like, you know? was that a canvas that you showed me a picture of? Yeah, I showed you. Yeah, it was, I, I had, like, I, I took me a little minute to do that because, like I was about to say, I, I work a lot. You mm-hmm. know what I mean? So I, I'll be sitting there just fucking around, and then I, I'll go back to it, and I'll be like, yo, I'm going to change this, you know, because I see things differently mm-hmm. over time. You, you can't know what do I mean? that. You just got to leave it, though. <laughs> like, it it's in the happens, street. Once it's done, it's done. If it's fucked up, where'd you go no, on yeah, the next yeah, one? Yeah, most definitely. So that's my issue, but I, I want to get out of that. Like, mm-hmm. You know what I mean? I want to be able it. to keep shit. And even if I don't finish it, that's fine. I want to move on and grow and build and succeed. You know what I mean? In my art, no matter how it is. That should be kind of like of a style, bro. Like as far as art, like doing shit, like just a little bit of everything. And what I mean by that is like doing like a piece. Like say you do the outline and you do like half of it color done. And you just got black and white and you have full color, just kind of different, like, you know what yeah. I mean? Yeah, most like, of yeah. shit, you know what I mean? Sometimes you go with scrap cans. Improvising, like, and there's times I've been with scrap cans, and I'm like, yo, like, like why ain't I doing this with, like, full cans blending yeah. and shit like this? I'm like, hell yeah. So that's, that's what I'm saying, you, like, you, you know, gotta you work learn. with what you got type you shit. You going out there. You come up with some dope-ass shit, man. Like, I heard that shit from Toop one time. He was like... If you use what you got or adapt to, like, if you run into an obstacle or something and you adapt to that, I tell my boys the same shit. Like, you got to adapt to it. Like, something ain't working right and it may not look cool right now, but, you know, fuck with that shit a little oh, bit. Oh, yeah, you, know you got to, especially when you're out there in the field. Oh, One time, me yeah, and Bree, you know, improvise. we saw when we first started doing rollers and we were like, hell yeah, let's, let's get one in. We ran out of paint and we're just, you know, growing up, we were, you know, pissing it. That's what That's we what did. It say. worked. Hello work. The God big man. homie says that on the fucking video. Yeah. Infamy. Like, he said piss in it, bro. Made it work. Yeah, that's what we do. Like, beer, piss, up. water. <laughs> there you yeah. go. Or maybe drink the beer and then piss. I mean, I don't, you know. And when we got into, like, the, the rhino, like, painting, like, downtown shit, we were just bar hopping a lot. We'd leave our fucking backpacks in the alley behind them in the bar, go in, get fucked up, take shots, <laughs> come out, and just paint all night. Nice. Like, it's cool, but... Definitely we, evolving. I know the how do you say? It? I had a video earlier, bro, where it's the rhino and it's like the rhino before the rhino. It's all graffitied up, all bombed up. You know what I mean? It's oh, like yeah. now it's a whole different. It's really accepted there now. It's kind of crazy. Really, you just draw daylight, like I said, take over walls. Yeah. Put a little bit. Uh, yeah, I remember me and Breed were locked up and we met Izzy and we were, and Izzy was telling us that uh, if you just run up with some fucking cones. And just make that shit look normal, bro, and just be cool with it. They, they ain't gonna trip on you in the rhino. And then, sure enough, after he told me that, it, it was dope to be in the rhino and bombing. I mean, it's funny, dog. He's doing it. It's funny you're saying that because I was just kind of like thinking that just the other day. I was like, I was just go, cruising by, I was like looking at the boxes, the big boxes, and I was like, I could. 
right now. Just get yeah. a little two cones, yeah. a little yellow uh, tape, my best. Legit. And I could probably do some right steps on some cool little it. colors, and oh, I could yeah. definitely like fit yeah. in. They probably wouldn't say shit. They they heard. Heard. Oh, man. Just like you said, your two coat little yellow tape, your vest, and yep. just kind of some cool colors. Like he's doing, he's, he's doing, getting paid for it. Bro. Yeah. Yeah. I've seen them like hitters, like like a Jacko. I've seen a video of that fool in Heiser. I mean, him on feds during the day. You know, they put the fucking vest on, bro, yeah. and that's yeah. that's, that's it. why I tell the bros, I'm like, I'm doing it for day. Yeah, like even when it comes to Home Depot, you know, the paint's just there for you. You just gotta go grab it. <laughs> And remember one night, shout, shout out to Iz, me and that boy, we, we went and hit a train and we got chased out of the yard one night. Izzy? Yeah, Izzy's cool yeah. Shout out Izzy, you know, that's one of those dudes I grew up with too. Yeah, he kind of, I watched him paint, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? I just, okay, I kind of wanted okay, to, man. I wanted to grow, you know what I mean? I wanted to, like when I was super young, you know what I mean? I wanted to paint. I just, I watched him build and him and, my, and Miser, you know what I mean? Phones on the on the him and Miser, mm -hmm. I uh, kind of looked up to them a lot when I was super young. You know what I mean? So it's tight to see him still around. You know what I mean? Hell uh, yeah. And, and tragic. What about you, man? Where you kind of want to see yourself in a year? You're young, so you're already kind of getting in where you want to be. Because you do different things as well, right, bro? Yeah. You want to talk about that? You're more than welcome, man. You know what I mean? Well, I want to see wanna... myself. Well, I want to see myself. It's, it's, it's the future, man. Right getting everything I'm coming for. I already got it. I already see what I'm looking at. I already know what I'm going. Yeah, I got the game plan, huh? I got the connects who I need to talk to, this and that. So just keep going, keep achieving shit. Like just doing what everybody thought I couldn't. Mm -hmm. Doing what I thought I couldn't, but we doing it. Yes, it's sir. Just, the name of the game. We going crazy. Proving them wrong. We going real crazy. I'm, on, I'm having fun. Yep. I can say that every day, like I'm having fun. Like, how your day goes? He's living that life. It's fun. I'm having fun today. That's how you gotta wake up every day, bro. Even though shit's rough or shit's fucked up. I had like three what things a day that fucked up in a row. And I was oh, like, motherfucker. Uh, you can't even tell. Can't even tell. Like, you're here handling business, bro. Can't even tell. We're still later. And we're still, fuck fuck later, and we're still you, late as yeah. fuck, smoking mad blunts. Great fucking podcast. Taking shots. You know what I mean? But just when it comes to RGK, I see it's like. We're gonna be, we still gonna be the same place we is, we on top, so that's what I see for the future too. Just heard that. Doing Are whatever you... makes us happy, doing what we do in the graphic shit. Mm -hmm. Make sure we stand as tall on the outside of graphic shit too, bro. No, uh, you definitely got a good team behind y'all, man, shit. Yeah, I know, thank you for shit. sure. I'm glad that y'all came on by, man, you know what I mean? Yeah, it's gonna yeah, be a good ass part. Really people gonna be you, listening to this shit, I fucking hope so, good man. shit. Shout out to the people. Hey, shout out to the people shout that listen to this fucking episode, man. Shout out to Joe Thunder, shout out to Be Good, that Be Good Weed. Big RGK. Big RGK, Ruthless Graffiti Kings. Mad love. This is Big Hurt Doug. Definitely been putting it down, man. Beyond this RG, group is gang. Do it, RGK, you know what it is. And there you have it. Your boy Joe Thunder, Smoking with Joe Thunder podcast. You can catch us on all platforms. Tell your homies, your friends, your Tell relatives. Your share, comment, subscribe, all that good shit. And check us out on YouTube, too. We got a gang of fucking videos up over there. Okay. And if you don't know about the old school one, what is it, Box State Music? Shit, yeah, yeah, if you don't know about Denver Box State Music, original. you better go YouTube that shit. Yeah, Denver Classic. And if you do shit. know, I'll fuck with you. Yeah, All right, man. All right we out of here. Peace. Peace. Oh.